I'm gonna try this out. This is Dick Tracy on Sega Genesis. I don't know why I have to show the box since the box is already on screen, but I'm showing the box anyway. <laughs> uh, now, I love the Dick Tracy comics by Chester Gould. I've read quite a lot of them. It's a, it's a great comic series, and if you haven't read it, you, you really should. Most people, when they talk about Dick Tracy, they're going to talk about the 1990 movie, but if I really could recommend anything, it's really to go back and read those comics. They're great. But anyway, uh, so this is the Sega Genesis game. Now, this is also on Sega Master System, which I believe is a much worse version. You guys know about the NES game, of course. And then the other day, we found a... Uh, uh, Game Boy game. So maybe I'll pop on the Game Boy game later, depending on how this goes. But let's get into this. This is Dick Tracy on Sega Genesis. Let's go. Who wants to start? Turn the music up a little bit. Touchstone. And go ahead, take it from me. All these guys sub. Thank you guys for that support. Appreciate it. This version is harder than the NES. Yeah, it, it seems tough. Let's see if I can beat level one. That'll be my first goal. This is really like, you are not allowed to fuck up at all. It's gonna be one of those, I think. I mean, you have, a, you have an energy bar, so you can fuck up a little bit, I guess. I just take two hits there, great. Fuck. Reminds me a little of the Punisher. With the shooting into the background, but this is, a, this is its own thing. Fuck. Oh man, if you get shot. Does it take two away? Fuck, this is gonna be hard. Thank you, Fearless Flyer. You gifted out subs to JXL77 and William Patrick. Thank you very much. And Skyora85 sub. Thank you. Centurion as well. Look at all these subs. Thank you guys very much. Were you a fan of the movie, Mike? Says Da Bomb1986. I was. Uh, and thank you, Sanguine1906. And thank you, Volton657. And he gifted out to Rub the Ducky. And thank you to All Day 180. Wow, a lot of subs just came in. Thank you guys very much. Uh, I was a fan of the movie, very much. That was crazy, by the way. Thank you. Um, Jesus, this is hard. Um, I wonder what setting I have this on. Um, I saw the movie in the theater. So, um, I, I, I really liked it. I know a lot of people didn't. Um, I think a lot of people at that time were comparing it to like Batman, you know, and that's a tough movie to compare anything to because that's such a great movie. But um, you know, I, I thought the Dick Tracy movie, you know, for what it was, was was pretty was pretty good movie. I think that was the problem with it. It came in an era where, where there was such, you know, high standards to live up to, that it was kind of like a little, a little hard to live up to that, but I think the Dick Tracy movie was pretty pretty decent. A lot of people like don't like Madonna in it for some reason. I thought she was fine. Um, I don't know. I thought it was fine. But uh, I was much more so a fan of the comics. I've, I've read a lot of the comics. I haven't read them all or anything. There's a ton, but um, they're, they're fantastic. Uh, Fanographics put out a collection of them, just like lots of uh, books, uh, different compilations of, of the old comics, and it's really, it's really, really good. Okay, so now I can only punch. John's Gaming Room sub. Thank you, John's Gaming Room. He says six months. Thank you. So I don't know how well this is gonna go or not, but we'll try it. I beat Rocket Knight the other day. Let's see how hard this game is, right? 
you want to see more complete libraries. Uh, are, do you mean of comic books? Because we're just talking about the Dick Tracy ones. You love that the movie stuck to six colors for the entire movie to match the comic, yeah. Well, back then, um, the, the old comics were four colors, so to watch the movie again. I don't know. There's probably some behind the scenes that says what they were going for. Thank you, Babin1386 and Games and Movies for 31 months. Thank you, guys. I should play Rocket Knight on 360. Yeah, people were saying that the that Rocket Knight's not very good, though, In my when I was streaming the Genesis game. Fuck. Guess I really gotta be more cautious here. God damn it. This is not going well. I didn't realize how difficult of a game this is. This is no joke. Well, we'll see what we can do. What is your favorite movie-based Nintendo game? It says Funky Tron, Batman. Um, was the first thing to pop in my mind. Um, but I can't really affect it, because that's one of my favorite NES games. But outside of that, um, I don't know. The Gremlins one's pretty good. Gremlins 2, like that's a good one. I don't know, and then you gotta think about like Super Nintendo era. Um, I mean, if, if I can base it off of a cartoon show, I don't know if I can, but Bucky O'Hare game is real good. But that was a TV show, not a movie. Motherfucker. Oh, is this like... Oh, my God. I, th I was trying to walk off the screen. Sh fucking... All right. I got to really focus on what I'm doing here if I'm going to get anywhere. So just consider all this practice. I'm just learning the game here. Itchy. Oh, is that like... Oh, is that the guy who's blue in the background? And he's gonna keep, I think he keeps running by and then I'm supposed to shoot him a, a little bit. There, and his life goes down. Then he's gonna get back up. Okay. That's interesting. So that's how they're doing this here. He's up here now. Shot him again. Shot this motherfucker in the dick. Oh, oh, fuck. This is crazy. This isn't easy to do. <laughs> this is like level fucking one boss, too, huh? Fuck me. He's gonna come out of that door, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, itchy, yeah. Oh, maybe not. Fuck. Oh, oh! I thought I killed that fucking guy already. Fucking shit. Alright, at least I know what's going on now. I'm gonna get so good at this one day, it'll be... I swear, I'll go through the whole thing, and it'll be no, no hit. Come back here in five years. I'll be, that's what I'll be doing. No hit, dick. <laughs> I 
<laughs> no hit dick run. Motherfucker. Itchy. Itchy and dick. They don't like each other. What's Dick's problem with Itchy anyway? What did Itchy ever do to Dick? I actually don't really remember him from the comics. Uh, but then again, it's been years since I read it, so. I don't really remember. I remember the kid in it. He's got like a kid, uh. I don't even remember what the fucking kid's name is. <laughs> That's how much I remember <laughs> at this point. I guess, guess I gotta reread them. He's got a girlfriend and shit. He's always getting in precarious situations. And the chief, there's a chief. <laughs> Big boy, huh? Bastard. These pink motherfuckers that come. So you gotta be really careful, careful of them because they'll. Oh, did I do it? Yeah. From the roundhouse to the big house for you, Itchy. This case is gonna blow up you in the face, Kappa. All right. So I actually beat level one here. All right, let's see the bonus round. Uh, oh. oh, I see. All right, I guess how to do it now. All right. That's this police chief over there. Flat top. Is it like Jimmy or some shit? Ah, <laughs> uh, hopefully that's the bad guy. All right, I'll know for next time. It's a cool little mini game. Itchy Richard. Oh, is that his full name? His, the, that bad guy's full name, his last name was Richard. Itchy Richard, it's a nice name. Playing Dick Tracy on Genesis. Yes, I am. Have you played this one before? Sob Hero. Shit. Oh, motherfucker. Hey, any of you guys in here ever played J uh, Jazz Jack Rabbit or Jazz Jack Rabbit 2? It's on PC. Have you guys heard of that game? Like, I was almost gonna play that today. Just don't know if anybody's played it. Fuck. Brutal but clean says never heard of it. Z Man says never heard of it. Gary Hum says he's heard of it. Great point and click do it. All right, so some pe some people, some of you guys have it seems. But a lot of people haven't. Okay. Jack Off Rabbit, sure. That's his name. Thank you, pooping pants. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, this motherfucker. These guys that duck and fire, that's a problem. Fuck, and these got a knife and shit? Jesus. Motherfucker! 
trying to stab me in the gut. Dude, the, oh, the, they're the fucking worst. They take away so much energy. Shot him right in the fucking face, though. Look at my health. It's like almost gone. So, you, so can you, do you get any health? I don't think you've. Oh my god. Is that it? All right. Oh, we, all right. They give you continues. Jesus. All right. Let me see. Thank you, Kenny Peel, for that sub, and thank you again, Pooping Pants, for the sub. Super Jeff says, Mike, this is one of my favorite Genesis games next to Ghostbusters and Quackshot. So, Super Jeff, do you get any health in this? Or, like, what's the deal? If you want to throw out any tips, let me know. This is my first time really playing it much. I played it a little bit before, but very little. You like how they just disintegrate when you kill them? Is this the room where the Ark of the Covenant is? Looks like it. Should be Indiana Jones, not Dick Tracy. There's that young Indiana Jones game on Sega Genesis. That's fucking dog shit. I wish it was like not young Indiana Jones. I wish it was Indiana Jones. Regular Indiana Jones. You know, if if they would have come out with an Indiana Jones game after Young Indiana Jones, would they have had to call it regular Indiana Jones? Regular adult Indiana Jones that you're used to the game. Just so there's no confusion. I don't think they would have done that because they don't care. They, they wouldn't have cared. They would have been. They would have just called it Indiana Jones and not given a shit. I think I made a checkpoint there, at least. There's no like real checkpoint indicator, so it's just like a certain point of the map. They they give it to you. Fuck. Oof, that was close. I got lucky enough to jump in between those bullets. Shoot him in the back of the fucking neck. I probably should have, since I haven't really played this before, I probably should have started this on easy, <laughs> but I didn't. When I started Rocket Knight, I played it through once on easy, and then I upped it. So maybe I'll have to do that so I can actually make it somewhere. I didn't realize how hard this would be. This is fun though, I like this game. Oh, there's a time limit too, I just realized, holy shit. Soldiers of Fortune. You're wondering if I like grill burgers or hamburgers? You prefer both? I mean, like, don't you just put a fucking hamburger? Don't you just, like, isn't that the same thing? I feel like if you asked if I like cheeseburgers or hamburgers better, that would make more sense. He really wants to know the answer to this. He's been spamming it into the chat for like 10 minutes. So. Spam burgers. My thoughts on the KFC console. Uh, I, I talked about that already. So, yeah, so the KFC con Yeah, somebody goes, why? Um, I don't know. I'll, fucking hamburgers and cheeseburger, they're fine. They're good. I don't know, man. Why? Why? <laughs> Why does it matter? Um, my thoughts on the KFC console. Uh, uh, so, they're making a KFC console. I think it's a marketing thing just to get attention for KFC. I feel like they'll make it, but they're not going to make many of them. And then it'll probably become like a sought after thing. If they end up making like tons of them, I'd be surprised. But, like, I feel like it's just going to be, like, a limited run thing. And they're, they won't make many of them. And I'm disappointed because I thought 
that you could literally buy chicken, put it in it, and cook it. But I looked into it, and what it actually is, you know if you have a PC and the inside parts of the inside of your PC can get hot or warm, uh, I guess they're putting a tray near the hottest part of the computer. So you go and you cook your chicken already, you get cooked chicken or you get cooked something, and then you put it in the tray and it just keeps it warm is all it does. It doesn't actually cook it. So I find that to be very disappointing. What I'd rather have is an actual, um, you know, deep fryer. I would like a deep fryer console to where like the, the, the grease is like splattering all over the place and you can make like french fries or something in it. Cause I would like to deep fry french fries inside of a, I don't know, a new Atari or something like that. <laughs> Maybe Atari and I don't know, somebody that makes good french fries can team up. But I want it to literally have hot scalding you know, deep fry, like, oil, like, shooting out of it. That's the way I want to be able to stream. Grease fires, yeah. It, and, it, yeah, and imagine, like, all that grease gets into, like, the computer. <laughs> I want the grease to be, like, <laughs> to be, I want it to be, like, really easy for the grease to get inside the computer parts so that, like, you could probably only use the computer one time before it just like short, short circuits and starts a fire. <laughs> it should come with a fire extinguisher. It's a one-time thing. It's like $20,000 cause it's like rare and everybody will want to get their hands on it. And then you get it and it just starts a fire. That sounds like a great console. I'm down. The grease fire console. Look at this shit. Hey, you big boy. Can I, like, jump? Oh, you can do that. showing how far I am progress-wise on this level. That's cool. I like that there's that progress bar. Fucker. Oh, shit. They're fucking me up now. these guys. Ugh. As long as I'm docked, I'm good, right? I hope. Oh, not even. Did he still shoot me? Fuck that. So you're not, like, safe behind the car. That sucks. Damn it. At least, oh, so I got to a checkpoint, though. Jeez. Ah. Whoa! This is wild. Come on, bastard. Yeah. Alright, we made it. Whew! I represent another pony interested in the nitro. Too bad you won't be here to find out who. I wonder how long this game is. 
Oh, motherfucker. Oh, the brow. I remember him. Oh, motherfucker. Am I ever gonna find this fucking guy? Ugh. Do I like literally have to, I can't shoot him that quick. What the fuck? Maybe I have to duck and like. How do you even? There's no way I'm gonna be able to do that that quick. He's so fast. Oh, there, finally, I got him. Dude, that's so hard. Oh. I don't think you can get him when he's in the foreground like that. Maybe by shooting like this. Son of oh my god. Dude, this crazy fuck. Oh my god, how do you do this? to be able to fucking roll or something. Like, how can you possibly fucking get out of the way of that? He's so slow. I wonder I wonder if there is actually, like, a fucking slide or something, like, because it's like... How the fuck am I gonna get... He's, because Dick Tracy walks so fucking slow. Ugh. Oh, oh. oh, so you can't shoot him like that. So that doesn't work because I guess he's, that's enough to be even be considered the background. Oh, this is impossible. How are you supposed to do this? Does he run in the movie? <laughs> right? Got him that time. Jesus. This is like, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Well, I actually got some hits in. doing better. A little bit. So now I know that he's gonna come out behind those fucking things. Like he'll probably come out from behind the car. Or not. Oh. Oh, now do I go back in the other fucking direction? You gotta be kidding me. Oh. It just... Alright, never mind. I thought it ended. No, it didn't. Wow. Okay. Almost got him. Oh. you. Alright, I, I learned how to do it after a while. At first, that seemed like it was a fucking impossible. Dead or alive, you're coming with dick. Bean, or sorry, Ben4FX subbed. Thank you. Oh shit, wait, I gotta do this. 
It's like I don't get any chance to look over. Fuck, he's a good guy. The chef. I didn't know the chef was a fucking good guy. I'm trying to figure out which ones are good and bad. Oh, he's bad. That dude's fucking bad, and the chef is good. God damn it. Gotta figure out which guys are bad and which one are good. I'm not even sure. So the dude in the black suit was bad and the chef is good. some of this shit. <laughs> oh my god. Can't be, you can't, no time to play around in this game. You can't fuck around. Oh, that was it, game over. Alright, so that was, what did I make it to, like, level three or something? I beat the brow, so however far that is. Uh, thank you, Mr. Bubbles. Mr. Bubbles subbed. Did I see Cobra Kai was bumped to January 1st now? I did. I did. It looks it looks like it'll be good. You got 8-bit Doe's new wireless arcade stick. It's pretty damn great. It looks like a giant NES advantage. Weighs 5 pounds. You can play Rastan and defend the house from, from intruders. I have quite a few arcade sticks. So wait, you said that was for what? Um, I guess for anything. What, for like playing on the Switch or something? We have a Switch uh, arcade stick. Actually. Thank you, one Matthew Robert. Hey, Mumra, have you played this before too? 3-A. Yeah, does anybody know how long this game is? I'm gonna try it again. A Switch arcade stick exists. It does. It also, it has that, like, red, sort of, like, Nintendo Switch, like, logo on it. Like, look, look it up. Yeah, it exists. Almost as good as the NES game. It's a lot more fun. It's a lot more fun, actually. So Dead Cal Frozen says he's played this, but he never got past the first stage. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, here let's see what this is. So okay, I, ha I had it on normal, I guess. I'm actually gonna put it on on easy, so we can see. Uh, well, how far did I make it to stage three? No, I'm gonna keep it on normal. Actually, yeah, if I put it on easy, I can make it further, but. I'll just keep it on normal, actually. Yeah, we'll just do normal. No hardest dick difficulty? There should be, right? Alright, here we go. Second attempt. Now I at least kind of get what this is going to be here. My Dixie Rex says this has seven, six or seven levels. Okay. Thank you very much, Ma Dixie Rect, for letting me know how many levels there are in Dick Tracy for Sega Genesis. I appreciate that very much, Ma Dixie Rect. Also, by the way, um, thank you very much for the sub. I appreciate that you're subbed. Thank you very much for that. I swear to God, half the people that sub to me just make up, like, names like this is, like, an episode of The Simpsons just to get me to read it out loud. My fucking cocks are racked. Oh, there's the other guy. Uh, you guys remember Fat Cock Jr.? 
Fat Cock Jr. used to sub to me. I wonder if Fat Cock Jr. actually is my Dixie erect, but he just changed his name. He's like, he's like, all right. I got enough laughs out of my fat cock. Now it's gonna go my dicks erect. Let's get him to say that. Ha <laughs> Somebody's having a lot of fun, as I can see. You miss Master Bader? What, there There was a Master, I, I, I vaguely think I can remember that. It was Master Bader. Master Bader? Has anybody seen a Master Bader? Come on, guys. Ma is that Master Bader in here? Wait a second. Duo says this game's insanely good and nobody talks about it. Yeah, it's been good. I just made it past the brow. Um, I'm playing on nor normal difficulty right now. And um, somebody was saying there's like six or seven levels. It's gonna be the mini game. Not yet. But I'm starting to find out that these kind of games where you shoot into the background, as I, as long as it's like a good one, I think I actually really like these kind of games. It's just that sometimes some of them are not that great. But when you find a good one, it's uh, I actually like this genre. Like, I actually ended up liking The Punisher. I used to think that I hated that game. Honestly, I used to think that game was terrible. And now that I replayed it, I was like, eh, I actually kind of like that. And and to be totally honest with you, when I play, re replayed through uh, Mylon's Secret Castle again, I actually kind of like Mylon's Secret Castle. Um, but it's understandable. I think that's a game, like, the first time you play Mylon's Secret Castle, you're going to hate that fucking game because it's very cryptic. Um, it's the type of game that you have to learn what to do before it becomes, like, fun, you know? But now that I know what to do, like, I beat the game, now it's like I, I'd go through it again and knowing what to do, and I feel like, you know, it'd be, like, more, more fun. It's also fun, actually, even the first time playing through, like, discovering those secrets, I guess, you know, that's part of the point of it, to discover those secrets. Um, so I actually kind of like that game, believe it or not. After all this time, I think I've decided that I like it. At least right now I do. Ask me again in a year, maybe I'll hate it, I don't know. <laughs> do I like this game more than the NES game? Um, yes. I'm one of the few people out there that doesn't totally hate the NES Dick Tracy. Uh, it's bad. It is bad. Uh, but I don't, like, hate it. Because cause there's the thing is, there's a lot worse games on NES than Dick Tracy. We've played, we've played a lot of them. Um, uh, but, it, but it's definitely not a good game. But I, I'm just saying, I think there's I think there's a lot worse NES games out there than that. But but yeah, this this is like actually a good game, though you know. Like this is like fun the first time you put it on. Dick Tracy on NES is kind of like. If you play it like a bunch, like if you owned it and you played it a bunch and you figure it out, it can kind of it can kind of be all right, a, a little bit, to the point where I can't to the point where I can't say that I hate it. So I feel the same way about Jekyll and Hyde. 
um, once you like really learn the game and know like what you're doing and shit, it's like, yeah, it's still fucking bad. It's absolutely 100% a bad game, but I don't totally hate it. There's some because there's some things that I like about it. Um, I'll tell you something that I actually really do legitimately like about Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Uh, not even joking. Um, when it, when you're Hyde and it like it goes nighttime and it's like dark, I think the atmosphere and the monsters and shit are actually really cool. Like, not even kidding. Like, I think I think they're I think that whole part's like really awesome to look at. Um, so that's more than I can say for some some fucking games. Now take a game like Action Fifty Two. That's just fucking. That's truly just terrible. Um, like, you know, you play all those games on there and they're all just not good, you know? <laughs> like, that that one's really actually bad. Thank you, uh, Alvinus1 for the sub. You think the atmosphere of Jekyll and Hyde is good in general? You like the fountains and the trees in the first level? Yeah, I guess even on the... On the um, the daytime thing, I guess the atmosphere of it's all right. Um, I think it's really cool at nighttime, um, but the game the gameplay is not good. You know, it's an interesting idea though. Like once you see exactly what they're going for about like how you walk and then you make it a certain distance and then you die and then you gotta like go back and stuff like that. It's just it's it's poor it's poorly executed. It's an okay idea that's poorly executed. I did well that time. Thank you again, Alvinus1, for that sub. I'm better at the bonus game than you are. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not too great at the rest of it, though, but I mean, I just started playing it. Did they ever make a Columbo game? They should. Peter Falk, right? Is that his name? Was it Peter Falk? Was he Columbo? And he was also in. What am I thinking of? Pr pr the beginning of Princess Bride? When he's reading the story? Do I have all of that correct? Or am I. How, how off base am I here with the, all, all this I'm saying? I think that was him. Yes, Peter Falker saying. Okay, I got that right. That's good. Got something right. See, it's more this shit that I have a problem with. The main thing. <laughs> oh yeah, what I wanted to know, for any of you guys that are familiar with this game, if you know whether or not there's health upgrades at any point, or is there just none in this game? And it's fine if there aren't, I'm just curious if there, if there are at all. I think I might have made it to the checkpoint here, so that's at least good. Fuck. <sighs> you like the game's music? Yeah, it's good. Why don't I look up video game manual scans? Because I don't want to. <laughs> How do you like that answer? Also, because uh, I, I own the manual. Or I kind of own the manual. You guys want to see this manual? Actually, I do own the manual. 
So sometimes people are like, Mike, why don't you look it up online? Or Mike, why don't you just look in the manual? And usually I'm lazy. Like a lot of times I don't want to look at, I don't want to go online and find some website that has the manual. And then you go looking and then you find a website and it's like, oh, it has manuals. And then you find out, oh, it doesn't have the manual I'm looking for though. It's got other manuals, but it doesn't have the one I'm looking for, whatever. Um, but I personally like to just figure games out on my own as much as possible. But I will say that for this game, Dick Tracy uh, on Genesis, I do own the manual. Now, I'd like to show you guys the manual, and I'd like to show you another problem that can happen with manuals. So here's the manual right here. There's the manual, right? Looks pretty good. And then uh, nice, nice looking art and stuff. So how do you how do you guys like this manual? This is this is a good manual. It's, it's good. So that's what I'm dealing with as far as the fucking manual. So maybe I could scan my manual and put it upload it to the internet. And then with some with some guy, I'm gonna make like my own manual site, and it's only gonna have one manual, and it's just gonna be that manual. It's just going to be, you know, dickmanual.com. Um, that doesn't... Anyway, um, I, I'm going to have a manual. Uh, let's just move on. I'm going to go back to the game now. That didn't, that didn't pan out the way I was hoping. I can't win with these streams. I, I don't know. I give up. <laughs> Dick, dickmanual.com <laughs> I think that might be something else. <sighs> anyway. What I was trying to say was that I don't like to break the manual out. I never did. When it was like Atari, if even like Atari games, NES games, whatever. I never wanted to get the manual out to read to read what to do. I always preferred games where you pop the game in and you can figure the game out pretty easily, you know, on your own without having to read a fucking manual. I don't want to read a manual. I'm very lazy with that. I don't want to do it. It's not that I can't do it. Sometimes sometimes I do, if I'm really forced to. We were playing Crystalis, and I broke out the manual for that, and that was fine, I guess. So sometimes I will, but I don't like, I don't want to. I don't like it. I want games to not. So that, so you know what, in the current day, to, you know, in current days, you buy a game and they don't have manuals. I can't really complain about that. But here's the one thing that I do miss about the manuals. I do miss the art. In the old manuals, you, you'd flip through it and it had all that good art. I liked flipping through the manual if I was in the mood to look at all the art. But I, don't, but I want to be able to pop on a game and just figure it out on my own. If I have to break the manual out, then I don't want to do it. Like, that's it. They're, and they make fun of that, too. They're Literally, the uh, home improvement game makes fun of that. And they say, you open it up and it says, real men don't read manuals. So basically, I'm like a real-life t t uh, Tim the Two-Man Taylor, you know. And, and you all remember what would happen to Tim the Two-Man two Taylor, right? He would not read the instructions or know what he was doing and then he would like staple his head to the fucking wall well that's pretty much what i do with these games i don't read anything i don't pay attention to anything i don't want to pay attention to anything i'm not going to pay attention to anything i never did and i never will so um i'm just gonna brute force my way through it and as you can see and as you have seen for many years now I, I, I get there eventually, one way or the other. I get there. So, what does it matter? Gorgamash subbed, thank you very much. He says, pop in a game. It sucks, 
It's hard? Play it anyway. Okay. That's what I do, yes. Leo says, don't you get frustrated after reading something you missed from just playing it? Reading something that I missed from just playing it? I don't, I don't know what you mean. Like, if I'm playing the game and then something happens and I miss it and then I and then something comes up and I and it tells me what to do and then I'm frustrated no because if something pops up I'm not going to read it anyway I don't read the things I'm not going to read it <laughs> period one way or the other so no it doesn't frustrate me cuz when it when it when the message pops up and it tells me I I get it out of my face cuz I'm not going to read it I don't want to thank you for gifting the sub to biz snes thank you Have you ever stuck an NES game into a Bible and then stuck that into a Game Genie and blown your NES's fucking mind? <laughs> like, put the game in the Bible and then, t and then take it out of the Bible? Because my thought was that if the NES game is in the Bible, right? You take an NES game, you put it in the Bible... And then you have the game genie. My my problem with that art that statement that you made is that the Bible will not then fit in the game genie. So the so only only way you'd have to do it is is put the game in there, and then take the game out. I don't think that I don't think the Bible will fit into the game genie. You still have to play Frankenstein on the NES. I beat that fucking game for the AVGN video, but I, I guess I have to do it again. Thank you, Da Tobias, for the sub. I had not done it on stream, so that's right. Well, I just did that the other day with Mylon Secret Castle, so that's what happens. I, you know what's another one uh, that I beat for AVGN and I have not streamed and beaten is Super Pitfall. Um, I've definitely beaten Zelda too enough, so. Definitely done that, but fuck! Oh, I went up to the top of that. Come on! God damn it! Super. Th here's the difference, though. Like Milan Secret Castle, I kind of like Super Pitfall. I, like Super Pitfall sucks. I don't really want to play Super Pitfall. <laughs> Maybe I'll do it one day, just because I'm a masochist like that. But uh, uh, I, I actually like Mylon Secret Castle to a good degree. Super Pitfall, no, not not really. I'd rather just not play Super Pitfall. It's not, it's not good. It's not a good game. <laughs> it's not good. That one's truly not good. And you want to talk about cryptic? You think Mylon Secret Castle is cryptic? Super Pitfall. That shit. That's that's major bullshit cryptic shit. Like shit you're never gonna figure out unless you fucking read it somewhere or something. Some bullshit like you can like fucking jump into like a bird to like I forget, I forget exactly what it is. Oh, you gotta like do that at the last second, huh? I'm like figuring this out. Um. It's like a part where you gotta like warp, warp from one part of the world or something to another part of the world in Super Pitfall by jumping into a bird. Now most of the game, most of that game, if there's a bird and you touch the bird, you get hurt. You know, it's like an enemy. So I'll make, I'll make the comparison. So let's say you're playing Super Mario Brothers. You're playing the game and there's Goombas and they hurt you. And there's Koopa Troopas and they hurt you. Right? You, but if you make it to stage seven, there's one flying Koopa Troopa that if you jump into them in the right place at the right time, it'll warp you to the end of the game or something like that. And it's like... How are you going to know that? And it doesn't even warp you to the end. It warps you to like another part of the map or something. That's some other bullshit. You got to collect card pieces. Like heart, the heart 
the spade, and all this shit. The game fucking sucks. Fuck Super Pitfall. The only reason I fucking did that was for that fucking video. Fuck that game. Super Pitfall could have been a better game. It could have been a lot of a better game. Thoughts on the Dick 64? That could have had mad potential. It could have. It could have. I, you know, you never know. That was for uh, the Nintendo 64, right? I've heard of that before. Yeah, I think that was a uh, Japan exclusive. Pretty sure. Very, very rare. And there's also that, uh, God, what's that other game called? Um, I'm not gonna be able to think of the name of it. Fuck. Hang on, I'm like trying to do this shit too. I got too many things going on. Damn. Oh. Well, at least that didn't kill me. Oh. Dead. So as I say that. I only got him like one fourth down. Oh, man, fuck this guy. I hate this part. Like that shit. I fucking hate that shit. And it's not like even the shit on the ceiling, you can tell like what he's. Like the section that he's blowing off, so it's not like you can really know where he's gonna do that. It's just like anywhere. Fuck. 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 I fucking hate this part. By the way, you know, you know, sometimes I talk about um, Genesis games where you gotta hop your fucking finger over. This is this is, this is one of those fucking games. I think this game should also have a fucking slide, like for situations like that. I think that's one way you could improve this game. Give, give Dick Tracy a fucking slide, for God's sakes. Like, poor Dick. Poor Dick can't do shit. He's too slow. Like that fucking bullshit. It's like, he, he can't move fast enough out of the way. It's like, you know what the you know what I want the controls to fucking be more like? Actually now that I think about it, I want it to be more like Adventures of Batman and Robin. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it. That would make this better. Cause it's not that I'm not fucking like fast enough to slide out of the way, it's that he's just like he doesn't have a move to fucking be able to get out of the way. He's just fucking slow as shit. That that much of it is fr frustrating. That's my. If I was reviewing this game, that would be my my ma major critique. Critique is that he should have a slide, in my opinion. But or some kind of dash or something. Like, Son of a bitch, where is he? Oh, now the stage is moving again. All right, so that was probably the checkpoint. The fuck's going on here? Fuck. Sit like that. What was I gonna fucking do?
I mean, make sure you hit him before he fucking knocks the things down, I guess. There. Thank you so much, Levance91, for gifting the sub to Yoke and Hyugen. Thank you, Levance91. All right, I got him, though. You need a yellow hard hat for this level. It would be called the dick slide. <laughs> yeah, you look in the instruction manual and be like, how do I do the dick slide? Oh. Down forward and B. That sounds great. You can change the controls. Well, too late now. And then I'll get confused. That's good to know, though. Fuck. Decent, decent. What is my favorite WWF game? Uh, I don't know, Ring King's great. I like the part where the guy gets in the corner and sucks the other guy's dick off for like an hour. That's That game's great. That one, that's my favorite. Play Sweet Home for Famicom. Yeah, you know, I probably will some someday. Actually, I own it. I have an actual copy of it. Um, I've never really bothered to mess with it much, but it's definitely a good idea. Some, maybe some sometime. Fuck this fucking shit. Have I ever streamed Zelda randomizers? Yeah, a bunch. I have indeed. Those are fun to do. Sometimes. This is hard. I'll tell you what, though. Zelda randomizers, that, there, a, a lot of people would probably be really interested in uh, me streaming lots of those Zelda randomizers. I prefer to stream really obscure things that nobody cares about. Games that only I care about. That's what I actually really prefer to stream. Ones that are like, so when people come in, they're like, oh, what's Mike streaming? And they're like, oh, what what the hell is this? I've never heard of this. Oh, I'm not, I'm not really interested to watch this. I have no idea what this is. Those, those are my favorite ones to, to, to stream. I'm like an anti-streamer, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> like, how can I get, how can I get people to be less interested and not watch? I would really... That's what I'm. That's what I try to figure out day by day by day. I think I do a pretty good job of it. I'm pretty. I'm pretty proud of myself in that respect. <laughs> better than the NES. Wait, what's better than the this game? Um, ne yeah, this game. Yes, this game is definitely better than the NES game. Absolutely, this game's good. It's just it's tough. Flight slime, play Flight Simulator 95, you will lose subs. Flight Simulator 95, huh? 
Oh, look at this motherfucker. Jesus Christ. Some people say Batman was better on Genesis 2. Uh, well, now there's a bunch of different Batman games on, on Genesis though, so you gotta, you know. So if you're talking about Adventures of Batman and Robin, I like that one better than the Super Nintendo game. Um, the Adventures of Batman and Robin. But then there's just plain old Batman, which is all right. I beat that game on stream. Um, I, I beat both of them. Um, it's all right. Uh, it's very, like, there's a lot of, like, uh, cutscenes in that that are really close to the movie, which is kind of cool, I guess. Um, there's a really cool shot of, this is, like, impossible. There's a really cool shot of uh, Jack Nicholson um, at the end of that Batman game. Um, saying whether the saying whether or not the NES Batman is better than the Genesis Adventures of Batman and Robin is like asking whether you love your mom or dad more unfair question. Um, hey, that's pretty tough. Yeah, actually, <laughs> um, that's definitely a hard question. I feel like I'm not gonna beat this level. That's how I feel about this, how this game is going right here. I, I feel like this game needs another move. Like, I'm sure you can like beat it without it, but I just feel like it's like lacking moves. And it's, and it's kind of frustrating. Yes, having no dick slide can be frustrating. I, you know, I agree. I think I think there should be a dick slide. You need the knee slide from Page Master. Oh my god, see? That game's fucking terrible. the fighting one? That's fucking terrible. Who the fuck is this guy? You know, that's another thing I don't like. I don't like when you pause, there's no music. Watch. I think there should be music when you pause the game. My, mine are a little gripe, but. the dude from The Office? <laughs> wait, wait, you're saying Dick Tracy is the dude from The Office? Oh, you're saying that, you're, oh, you're saying that's Kevin. <laughs> that's Kevin from The Office. <laughs> With the fucking Uzi. That was pretty good. I think you're right. I think it's Kevin.
The problem with this game is I have to be like super fucking on the ball with this. I'm not like feeling that right now. This is a this, so this is a no fucking joke around game. I wasn't I wasn't ready for I wasn't ready for like serious gaming tonight. <laughs> I've been playing like Action 52 and shit where it's just like whatever, you know? Where it doesn't matter. Now I'm being thrown into like real real deal shit and I'm like not prepared. So I gotta work my way up to this. Like there's like, you know there's like some games how you can just kinda like fucking beat it and fall asleep. Like for me, like Super Mario World, like I could, if I'm asleep, I could beat Super Mario World. It's like it's like you're not, it's like you're not even playing it, you know. Or if you're playing Action 52, it's like those games don't matter, <laughs> you know. <laughs> so it's just like you're not even paying attention to what you're doing. But this is like actual, like oh, okay, now I'm playing a real game again, okay. You also, you, so you really gotta pay attention to which guys pop out first, too, I'm noticing. Cause you gotta get the guys that pop out first, cause that gives them enough, th that fucking part is like, that's like where I want like a fucking slide or something to fucking do something with these guys. So I'm like, I die there every time. I wanna get, even if I fucking die overall, I just wanna fucking get by that one part. This is addicting. I'll tell you what though, even though I do I do feel like this game should ha should have had a slide, the fact that it doesn't is better because that kind of makes me feel like like they're take like it's harder because they took something away from you that you would think you would have. So I kind of like it better actually that they don't have it because it's almost like challenge mode. <laughs> It's almost like the game was designed with challenge mode. Fuck, this fucking part. I don't fucking know. Thank you for gifting that sub to Haunted Castle Pro. Wouldn't sliding on the ground be out of character for Dick Tracy, though? Um... Maybe a little bit. I don't think entirely. I don't think entirely. I could see Dick Tracy like sliding on the ground away from something in a fight or something. Um, but yeah, he's not like fucking Batman or something, you know. So a little bit out of character, but I, I think he could slide. I don't think that would be totally off the mark. Might be hard to in that trench coat though. <laughs> Kevin. If I know the exact part when that one when those two guys are gonna roll out, then I could fucking handle it probably, but I never do. <laughs> Oh, 
I wonder if that was it, actually. Holy shit. Oh no, it's like with these windows. I'm gonna try to pay attention so that I know. It's a bunch of these windows. I'm gonna get killed. Huh? No. Fuck! Fuck! Oh! Took two. That shit takes two away. It takes two, baby! I jumped! Fucking dick! <laughs> there it is, you've been waiting for that comment, right? So there you go. Oh, they're wrecking me. I definitely put should have put this on easy first. I'm throwing myself into the into hell here. Sorry, I haven't been looking much at the chat. I'm like very focused here. Next time I die, I'll stop for a second. Should probably be very soon. They're dead. So, oh, it's where those fucking blue buildings are. Or the, the, the blue uh, windows. All right, let me catch up with you guys, sorry. There are no health pickups. Thank you, Pharaoh Bacon, okay. Yeah, at this point, I figured there wouldn't be, okay. Dick Tracy was honestly better before the Madonna movie, in your opinion. Love the episode with the bank robberies and the gas that made people freeze. Before the Madonna movie? Do you mean... Do you mean earlier on in the movie? Or do you mean before the movie came out? I mean, like I was saying in the beginning of the stream, I personally like the comic books. Like the original comics. Oh, okay, duo. I didn't. I wasn't aware of that. Why the hell did they choose yellow for his attire? I mean, listen, it's a thing from the 1930s, I think. I believe the uh, comic started then. Um, you know, it was in black and white then, and he just he had a trench coat. Why they make it yellow? Because it was a it was a comic book. I mean. I mean, why is Batman always in purple <laughs> in everything you've ever seen? Actually, did you guys ever see the uh, old... There's an old comic book of Batman where he's in pink, and then one of the Adam West episodes, Batman's also in pink. I would love to see them do a serious Batman. That would be the best thing. Make... I'm so... T there's so, been so many fucking Batman movies. Next time they make a Batman movie, I want a serious take on Batman. Um, very serious take on it, but I want him to wear pink. I want a pink bat suit, and nobody should fucking even acknowledge it. Like he could totally kick people's asses. He could like, I mean, look, listen in the in the Batman movie with Jack Nicholson. Batman like kills people in that movie. He's like shooting people with the fucking bat plane and shit. I want a Batman movie that's like super hardcore serious. He's killing people. He's decapitating people. He's taking their fucking batarangs. He's just killing them. He doesn't care. None of, none of this Batman doesn't kill people stuff. No, Batman kills everyone. But he wears a pink costume. That's the Batman movie I would like to see. Bright, bright pink. Ne like neon pink. Hot pink. I'd like to see that. Not also by the way, not like muted pink, like it's like kind of like dark, like shadowy like pink. Not, none of this, like bright fucking pink. Like the shit is pink. <laughs> it should be called Batman Kills Everybody. Yes. Tell me you would not go see that if they made that. If it was like had the budget of the Christopher Nolan movies, and Batman has a pink Batman costume, and the movie's called Batman Kills Everyone. You know you fucking will go see that. There was no, there's none, no person here would not go fucking see that movie. You would see it. They would sell the fucking tickets. You know? I want to see that movie at least. 
Somebody in Hollywood needs to hire Mike. You know what? They should they should give give me a shot for just just for just for a year. Give me a shot for one year. You know what I would do? I would purposely make shit that I know would, would not do well. Just to be an asshole. It'd be like the worst thing ideas like ever. And see, secretly I would just I'd be laughing to myself because I know I'd just be putting putting everything out of business and laughing to myself. <laughs> Because you know, some men just like to watch the world burn, as they as they say. Some men like to watch the world burn. <laughs> what are they, like the worst ideas? I do a hundred million dollar Beethoven Nine, the most expensive dog movie ever made. It would be shot on video. The dog would not be trained. It would just be some dog. I would just find a dog. Like, you know, you see somebody walking their dog out on the street. That that dog, that's the one. It'll be that dog. It doesn't even matter. I don't care what, what type of dog. It's not gonna be trained or anything like that. It can't do anything special. It's just a dog. It just sits there. There's no real plot. Maybe there's some kind of loose plot. Dog walks around or some shit. I don't know. $100 million, it'd be great. Would I ever try Dark Souls mo mods? Uh, would I try Dark Souls mods? Yes, I would try that. Depending on what they on what the mods were. You know how there's the Grand Theft Auto mods? If you could play Dark Souls, but play like go walk around Dark Souls with Kermit the Frog or something like that, I would 100% do that. 100%. I would like to go through and beat. Dark Souls with Kermit the Frog. Hi ho! Oh, let's let's go to Blight Town with Miss Piggy. Fuck! Almost. Damn it! Having a hard time with this. Who would be the villain in a pink Batman movie? Um, I can tell you exactly who the villain would be. There is an episode of the Adam West Batman and there is a villain called the Siren. And she has a loud, um, high-pitched squealing that she does. And that's her, um, That's her thing that she does. You know, they all have their thing that they do. Like Mr. Freeze freezes shit or whatever. The Riddler does his riddles. She just screams. But it's it's a scream that's not just like a ah. It's a it's like a high pitched squeal that makes it to where you want to literally turn your television off. That's one of the only Batman episodes that I literally I can't watch it. I have to like turn it off because the the, the noise is just like a piercing. Horrible noise, like when a, when a, your alarm goes off in your house and you just want to turn it off as quick as possible because it's a horrible noise. It's like that. People would walk out of the theater. That's that's what I, that's who I would have in the movie. Only difference is I would see if I can make the squeal a little worse, a little bit more annoying than that. Maybe a higher pitch or something. You know what? All, all the all the money, fuck this. I like cannot do this. All the uh, all the money that would go into the movie, or most of it, would go into figuring out how to make the most horrible squealing sound possible. To the point where, like, you know, people would be asking for their money back, and it'd be a big problem. Everybody would be very angry about it. People be walking out of the theater holding their heads. That that would be fantastic. So the siren, that's my answer. Can I blow up the crates for power-ups? I don't think so. 
What do you think this is? The Punisher? No, I don't think you can. Let's see. I will try it right now. Doesn't seem like it. I wonder if I go like just a little bit up each time if that'll be better than like if I'm walking too fast Maybe that's part of the problem Maybe I have to take my time a little more very well could be that duck it's like and then they take two fucking things away these are the guys that are getting me Th these fucking guys especially when they roll behind you god and what is this like the third fucking level I can't imagine how this gets Bitch, got ya. <sighs> I just heard Aaron slamming on something. I wonder what's she playing? Anybody watching Aaron stream? <laughs> I don't usually <laughs> Usually she hears me. I, I just heard her get pissed off on something. <laughs> She's doing Shinobi? Oh shit, Shinobi. Really? Oh, that's right. You know what? I, I saw her playing that. Yeah, Shinobi's... That's hard. <laughs> that's hard, too. <laughs> Fuck. I bet. I'd be pissed off, too. Oh, did I fucking just make it? Oh, did I, did I finally fucking beat that? I wasn't even paying attention that time. That's the time I beat it when I'm like not paying attention. Okay. That, that's the story of my fucking life right there. You guys ever have that experience when you're playing video games? You just like, you try, you try and you try and you try and you're like really trying hard. And then, and then like, you know, somebody comes in the room, somebody's talking to you. Or something like that you're like distracted but you're still playing the game and then you beat it and you're like wait what i beat it jeez i don't even know <laughs> i don't even know what happened it makes you feel bad because it's like all those times where you're trying like intensely you can't do it and then all of a sudden just like you just beat it without even thinking it's like what the fuck? how did that even happen Like you you know what happens, I think? I think your instincts come like take over. Your subconscious just takes over and just does it for you. I just need that to happen all the time. Oh fucking hell. Is that it? No. Damn it. Dude, I hate this motherfucker. How many? Is it like a fucking clown car? How can you have this many motherfuckers in a fucking car? I 
bunch of fucking horse shit. You say, oh, Mike, but it's a video game. Really? Is it? Ah, fuck you. Yeah, we made it. All right, now what? Now I'm gonna have another fucking boss to fight. Now I'm fucked. How nice of you to drop by, Tracy. Care for a Molotov cocktail? Oh, great. Now I'm fucking screwed. Was that him? Did I get him? God even knows. Oh, look at this shit. Lips. Lips versus dick. Who will win? I'm hoping Dick will win. Fuck. It's like, I don't even, like, does ducking behind these tables even do anything? It was at the end? Great. That's all I got to fucking try. So I don't even know if ducking behind those tables does anything. I guess, I guess Lips won. Thank you, Choo Choo, for the sub. Lips would eventually get dick tired. Game over, dick. Thank you, Sergeant Palpatine. Yeah, I'm used to it, though, duo, so I'll just keep it. All right, I'm gonna take a break for a minute and we will uh, we'll try it again. We will be right back with some more D. Yes, exactly, Belmont. How bad is this game? This game is not bad at all. It's just hard. All right, let's get it going. This is Dick Tracy for Sega Genesis. Let's try it again. What is the armor in this game? A condom? Ha, ha, ha. Probably what it is. So fuck. So fuck. <laughs> it's not easy. It's not easy. So in the sections where you're walking, there's no uh, like meter on top to tell you how much further you have to go. They only do that on the driving sections. You know what I do like? There's no uh, limit on ammo. It says that, like, in the cutscene, I think, on the next stage, because they want you to, like, use your fists, but, like, on most of the stages, you know, it's, it's unlimited ammo, which is, which is cool. Fuck! Alright, well, great. Let's start this over. Get through the first fucking stage. Played near automata. No. It's 
quite the name, though. It's, you can almost pronounce it. I would, I would love it. Would I? I have to try it. I don't know. It's an action RPG. Oh, okay. Well, I probably would like it. Can't say it, but I might like it. Ni ni -er automator. Thoughts on Intellivision Amico? Um, no. <laughs> not not doing that. You need a mod of this Elvis in a jumpsuit shooting TCB Thunderbolts? That would be awesome. Does Mike read? No, never. I've never read anything, ever. The only thing I read is my chat. It's the only thing, that's the only thing worth reading as far as I'm concerned. I only read my chat. I've given up on reading everything else. I don't see any reason to read anything else. Why would I? Why would I do that? I only I only take in information that you guys tell me. That's it. You and Wikipedia. I trust Wikipedia. It's a great American website. Love it. It's always got you can always trust it for information. You always trust it to know that it's right. So let's let's see what my chat has to say. Uh, the only stuff that I read. Let's see. Um, Dickopedia. Trustworthy Dick. Mike drinks beer and doesn't read. Damn right. <laughs> Nair Year Automatia is an action RPG with bullet hell elements. That's cool. I mean, I probably like it. You read books because you are a snobby piece of shit and you like to rub it in everybody's faces how smart you are. That's good. I like to only read my chat. Ni saying Niar Automata makes you sound like Chekhov when you say it. Niar Automata. <laughs> um... Alameda. You're in Alameda. Schmegma. No, but in all seriousness, so, so no, I have not played that game. I, I really can't fucking pronounce it, but I have not played it. But uh, from what you guys are saying, it, it does sound like a game I might enjoy. So maybe one day I will try it. I don't understand what the name is. So that's a little weird, but it's a weird name. Nuclear vessel, nuclear vessel, or there's the um, uh, photon torpedoes. Armed. Yes, Captain. Nuclear vessel. Somebody goes, near. What's up, Doc? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Bugs Bunny plays near automata. Nair. Nair. Automata, Doc. <laughs> Shit. 
train hopping dick. Look at him go. He's like a rabbit right now. <laughs> you see a guy coming at you in a trench coat doing that? You better fucking run. <laughs> I'd be fucking running. <laughs> oh my god. You know, you like this, how tall is Dick Tracy? Like, a fucking six, eight, you know? I, that's how I imagine him anyway. He's like almost seven feet tall. He's got this fucking. He goes to the fucking big and tall shop with his fucking yellow, bright yellow hat and bright yellow fucking jacket. And he. <laughs> going down the road like that. And you're like. What the fuck? Aaron, how tall do you think Dick Tracy is? Hmm. I haven't seen the movie, but judging by this video game, I would say... 5'9". Oh, you think he's shorter? Yeah. He's either like... You think he's a short little fucker? I don't know. Maybe it's... I thought he was like seven feet tall. Well, I gotta see him compared to the other dudes. Okay. Well, let me get I mean, I'll be chance. back down in a minute, but... Well, wait. One okay, second. Hang on. Don't... Oh, no. It's going to be the car thing, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Like, well, that guy's in the back. They're in the background. Here, like that guy right there. Okay. Well, see, that guy looks tall. So maybe he is, like, 6'2", perhaps. Maybe he's 6'2"? I'm going to go with 6'2". All right. <laughs> <laughs> And I wasn't expecting that question. Did you beat Shinobi? I did, but the Sega Ages version. But I'm gonna try the arcade version again tomorrow. Oh, is that not the same thing? It's a little different. Uh, I did not know. Alright, let's see if Dick can take care of Itchy. Dick takes care of everything. You bet it does. <laughs> and she's gone. <laughs> They're laughing. music loop is like Motherfucker. All right. This case is gonna blow up in your face, Kappa. Warren Beatty was six two. Okay, there you go. Is his name Richard, or is he a dick because he's a detective? He's a dick because he's a detective, but I think his name is also Dick. Because he is a dick? He His name is Dick? Yeah. But he is a dick because he's a private dick. Is he also a dick in the sense of, like, his personality? Um, or is he yeah, a probably real, a little bit. Yeah. He's, he's kind of like me. He's kind oh, of okay. like a little bit of a dick. He's a good. He's a good guy, though. Like overall, he's like the good guy, but he's kind of. He's a little bit. He's just a little dick, but he's that's fun. Dick, that's always you know? fun. You know. Yeah, that's He's good. a little bit of an that's asshole. You gotta be. You gotta be well rounded. I mean, he's taking care of all those bad guys. You can't be too nice. You know. Yeah. You gotta be able to rough them up a little bit. <laughs> Fuckers. Fuckers. <laughs> Kick their fucking asses. Fuckers. <laughs> hmm. 
you know, can't be can't be too nice. It's like you know, think about Batman when he's like interrogating the Joker. You know, was Batman's not that nice of a fucking guy. You know, you know, in the end of the day. You know, you want Batman on your fucking side, you know? But Batman is not really that nice of a fucking dude. He'll beat the shit out of you if he wants to. Batman will do whatever the fuck he wants. Like, don't fuck with Batman. You know when he goes in the room with the Joker in the fucking police headquarters and he's like, And the Joker's like, ah, Don't touch me! Ah, please, God! Oh, God, help me! <laughs> Basically, it goes like that, and you're like, wait a second, which one actually is the villain here? <laughs> Kinda feel a little bad for the Joker. He's like bashing his fucking face in. <laughs> you know. I think Dick Tracy's got a little of that. Not not as much as Batman, but Dick Tracy's got a little of that in him. Rough him up a little bit. I mean, look at look at this fucking game. I mean, really, Dick Tracy's a fucking mass murderer. And look how many people he's killing. Just hundreds of fucking people. How does he know that one of the people that walks out of this door isn't somebody who happens to live in this building? And they walked out, and he's in their fucking house. And they're just protecting, like, their fucking... Like, that could be somebody's apartment back there. Like, Dick Tracy could totally be a fucking murderer. Like, who fucking knows? I don't know, you know? You never know. You gotta be careful. Joker has a heart on when the bat pelts him, though. That's true, he gets off on it. Ooh, hit me again, Batsy! <laughs> That's the way I like it! <laughs> Give me another slap on the rump! <laughs> <laughs> mm. Ah! Shot his balls off. <laughs> just shoot somebody's fucking nuts off. Just shoot him right off. Fuck him. It's like Dick, Dick Tracy's busy doing. He's like, hey. Blow your fucking balls off, motherfucker. <laughs> I don't give a shit. I've already killed a thousand men today. You think I care about shooting your balls off? Not at all. It doesn't, doesn't bother me in the least. What a guy, that Dick Tracy. Oh, look at this situation. Like, what, 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 what would you do? Bitch, yeah, what were you gonna do? Don't stand up when somebody's doing that. When you see a thousand bullets coming at your face, you might want to duck, motherfucker. Oh, shit. What, what, what? What, what, what? What, what, what would you do? What would you do? You guys remember that? Does anybody here remember what would you do? Well, that was the name of it, right? Or was that just a thing? What would you do? Yeah, what would you do? I got it for, oh, that was Mark Summers, I thought so. I think Mark Summers should be given the Nobel Prize. Anybody else agree with me? Unwrapped? You guys ever see Unwrapped? That show's fucking great. Fucking Double Dare. What would you do? Give Somebody give the man the Nobel fucking prize. I mean, come on. If I was in charge, he would have, he would, he would have them all. <laughs> Thank you. 
What, what, what would you do? You like your shows the way you like your wieners, unwrapped? Ah. Have I seen Mark Summers and Burt Reynolds clip on The Tonight Show? Uh... Mark Summers and Burt Reynolds on The Tonight Show? No. What happens... Who's on... Is that the Carson era? That couldn't... No, that would have to be... Maybe? No. Is that Leno? I have not seen that. And now I need to know what happens. Tell me all about Mark Summers and Burt Reynolds on The Tonight Show. I would like to know nothing more than that. This is why I only need to talk to my chat. They tell me all the juicy info. See? You see? You see why? You see why I only talk to you guys? <laughs> they had a slap fight? They got angry at each other? Really? Okay, I'll have to check that out. So, speaking of Mark Summers, years and years ago in New Jersey, in Atlantic City, Mark Summers hosted The Price is Right, and they were doing The Price is Right some kind of show of The Price is Right in Atlantic City. And Mark Summers actually hosted it, and they actually called me up onto it. I got called up to the, what do they call it, the contestants row? That's as far as I made it, though. I didn't get on stage. I guessed wrong. I guessed wrong, unfortunately. Very, very big disappointment. Back there still ah bastard. At least I kinda know what I'm doing now. You fuck. Oh I got him. Jeez. Whoa! Where is he? Where is he? Damn it. Fucker. Jesus. I almost got him. Come on. Look, look at this. You can't even see him. Got him. All right. Was called the blow instead of the brow. <laughs> well, brown me down. Playing Punisher on NES with Doom music is bloody brilliant. You know, didn't it really fit well? I thought it fit fit well. That's what she said. <laughs> uh. 
Ugh. Alright. Fuck you. game should just be that because apparently I'm really good at that part more so than the other shit what would you do Van Star Bastion something says cheers Mike I'm getting wasted tonight glad to see you playing this classic I'm glad to hear you're getting wasted it's good Enjoy that. Enjoy. Enjoy the stream. I'm glad there's plenty of uh, dick entertainment for you tonight. <laughs> plenty of dick for you tonight here. On Mike Matei Live. I always like to give the people what they want. Anyway, so we were talking earlier about uh, Jazz Jackrabbit 2. Jazz Jackrabbit. I was also thinking about, um, so I was thinking of playing that, but I was also thinking about playing uh, Rayman. How do you guys like the Rayman games? Because I think, so, I know there's like a bunch of them. Um... But I believe, please correct me if I'm wrong, I think the first one's on PS1, PlayStation. Um, I think. So I was thinking about maybe trying that one. Maybe. I don't know. There's a lot of games I'm considering playing. I kind of like, like to play Diablo again, too. I've done that on stream, but I want to do the... I, th I think I did the a console version of that, actually, and I want to do the PC version. I think it was a console version. Which is not what I would have prefer. I think that's all I could I could get running at the time or something. For whatever reason. Fuck. Let me see. Uh, you've never played Rayman, however you bought Rayman Legends on PS4. Or yeah, Rayman Legends. Yeah, I played a little bit of that. Rayman was on Jaguar first? Was it? Mike, are you reading this? Mike? Mike, are you reading this? No, I'm not. I didn't see it. Nope. Commander Keen, yeah. Diablo 2, yeah. Purple Bricks? Yeah. You didn't see it at all. Nobody really said, like, what they, like, a lot of people are saying that they played it. Did you guys like it, though? Ray, like, the first Rayman game. Like, is it worth playing? I saw a lot of people said that they have played it, but do, like, do you like it? Is it worth playing still? Or not really? Because I have not played through that on stream yet. You like the first one, it's okay. You only play the second one. People are saying it's okay. Nobody's, okay, so it's like okay. So nobody's saying it's, it's like amazing. People are like, it's okay. So it's like an okay game, it's like fine, but it's not like amazing. Is that is that the consensus then? And a lot of people are saying it's it's difficult. Okay. 
So it's a difficult game. It's like, and it's okay. Okay. Well, you're not getting me super excited about playing it. You you prefer Jazz Jack Jackrabbit? Okay. Did I have a stream to Earthworm Jim? Um, I play, I've done a little Earthworm Jim in videos. Um, not, I'm honestly I'm not like super big on it. Um, I think it's okay. I, I kind of like Earthworm Jim, but I'm not like I'm not huge on Earthworm Jim actually. Um, but yeah, I mean I played it. It's all right. I feel like a lot of people like that one a lot more than I do. I don't know, I just never get too super into that. It's alright though. era. I wish cars still looked like this. Actually made that. Yeah. Cool. You love 30s and 40s car. I, I do too. I like old um, bicycles too, like from the Ford, like Ford 1940s bicycles, like old Schwinn's and shit. So this guy just is fucking me. I don't know what to do here. He's just continually hitting me. I'm gonna assume getting behind these tables can help, help me. I, like, I don't even know. Like, not even, like. So I'm having trouble with this part because I feel like I have no protection. Maybe I just have to like walk out of the way. I'm just gonna like run, I guess, like that. Jesus. Alright, I think I might have a. If I do. If I kinda do that, sort of start walking away, get a hit and run. That, you know? what they want you to do. Whoa! Is he gonna come out of the fucking door or something? Shit, man. What's gonna happen? Dude, I don't fucking know. Oh, it keeps going. Alright. Oh, oh, shit. Oh my god, it's different. Okay. Oh shit, come on. I'm not fucking ready for this. There we go. Apparently he can't throw all the way over to the right, so that's good. Okay. What's your interest in mm, dick lips? 
Thank you, GG. Tilty McSteamer says he likes old dildos from the 1800s. Yeah, that's back when they were made out of like wood and steel, right? More so. I pretty pretty much right. Usually. Back in those days, long time ago. Will I get the KFC console? If it's possible to get, um, yes. I'll probably make an attempt to get it, I guess. Oh, fuck, come on. Oh, that's the fucking good guy. Shit, man. Come on! Usually I'm better at this. my favorite part of the game actually <laughs> I like that mini game <laughs> I, w I wish there was a whole game just out of that mini game thank you the Ron 1360 and a, and a very Merry Christmas to you I don't know why I just turned into kind of fucking character but I'm like lucky charms all of a sudden pink balloons <laughs> Clovers, or whatever the fuck, I don't know. Whatever he fucking says. Red balloons. Oh, look, look, look at this fucking situation. Punch him in the fucking balls. Oh! Oh! It got new moves! Since when do they have new moves? Now I definitely need a slide. Oh, fuck this! Okay. Now, now this is a bunch of shit. Where's my knife? I don't have a fucking knife. Dick Tracy doesn't have shit. I don't have a gun. I'm a knife. Got nothing. Got, got dick. Yeah, exactly. Got dick. Motherfucker! This is a And he looks like the fucking Riddler or some shit. Dude, this level fucking blows. He won't, the knife dude, you can't even kill him. I need the fucking gun. Dude, fuck this knife man, okay? This is bullshit. Here, you're gonna. You're gonna fucking die. I'm not going any further unless you're fucking dead. Lucky the leprechaun, motherfucker. We're doing this. Looks like Clark Kent, by the way. This motherfucker with the gun. Imagine if Clark Kent had a fucking gun. You know, Lois, I'm having a bad day. <laughs> don't, don't fuck with me. <laughs> I don't know. You know, one too many encounters with Lex Luthor or whoever the fuck. You know, see all these motherfuckers I gotta deal with? You know who I am. You know who I really am. You're the only one that knows. You're gonna be a pain in the ass to me today? I don't even have to, you, you realize I don't have to be Superman to be a fucking problem for you, right? What are they gonna do, throw me in jail, Lois? I'll bend those fucking bars. I'll, I'll, I'll bend those fucking bars. 
<laughs> what are you gonna do? So you better not fucking give me a problem. Hey, what, oh, kryptonite jail? You gonna make a kryptonite jail? Yeah, where are you gonna get the kryptonite? Where? Where are you gonna get it? A whole fucking jail out of kryptonite? You're gonna make that yourself. You work at a fucking newspaper company. Like, where are you getting that? I don't think so. So you better not give me a hard fucking time today, Lois. She's like, I just asked you if you wanted some oatmeal, Clark. He's like, oh, oh, is that what you said? Shit, I'm sorry, Lois. I thought you said something else. Sorry. Yeah, I'd love some oatmeal. Love you, Lois. <laughs> I'm gonna go melt some steel beams with my eyeballs. See you later. What kind of relationship is that? It's really fucked up. He's like, yeah, by the way, I'm, an, I'm a fucking alien. You know that, right? You know I'm a fucking alien? Like, I'm from another planet. Is that a problem for you? I think it should be a problem for you. Like, to some extent. You seem to not even give a shit. I could crush you with my fucking toe if I wanted to, Lois. It's like, Clark, just eat your fucking oatmeal. Oh yeah, thanks. This is, this is the kind I like, right? This is the cinnamon kind? Better fucking be. <laughs> yeah, this level is very hard. Those fucking knife jumpers, yeah, exactly. How come Superman doesn't use his x-ray vision to look at titties? How do you know he doesn't? How do you fucking know he doesn't? He, there was never, like, he never had a statement, like, By the way, ladies and gentlemen, I've never used my x-ray vision to look at titties. He doesn't say, go around saying that. He's always looking at titties. All of them. He's seen them all. He has seen them all. Whether he likes it or not, he's, he's got that supervision. He can't, I don't think he can help it, frankly. I don't think he can turn that shit on and off. It's like, ooh, uh, sorry, I just turned my supervision off. Like, that shit's just on. He sees it all. The, pro the problem, though, is that he sees through, through the titties, and then he sees, like, through the person's fucking skin and their muscles and their bones and cells and shit, and he sees through that, and he sees to the next person, and he sees through them, and then he sees, like, a, the building beyond them, and then he sees through that fucking building. Like, it's a fucking, it's like, he's on another fucking level. He's, he doesn't care, you know? When you, when you got that shit going on, you're like, you know. It's a whole, whole nother fucking issue. He probably would like to just have fucking normal vision sometimes, I'm sure. It probably gives you a fucking headache, you know? You're looking through like 20 fucking things at the same time. He's probably like, Jesus Christ, you know? I just wanted to look at my breakfast and I'm, I'm, I, I can see, I can see California from here. Like, this is a fucking problem. Man, I don't know if I can beat this fucking level. Superman. Superman sees turds moving through your intestines. Yeah, exactly. Superman, you know, yeah, he's it'd be like, oh, Superman should see, see your boobs. It's like, yeah, Superman, yeah, Superman can see your boobs. And then he looks down and he sees the shit going through her fucking stomach, though. It's not always, it's not the greatest thing to be Superman. You know? You got all these motherfuckers trying to kill you. You got Doomsday walking around. He's like, ah, I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'm from another planet. Arr. Whatever. You got that shit going on. You got Lois being a pain in the ass. And you still gotta go to your job and take fucking photographs or whatever. Why does he even do that? Dude could fucking take over the fucking planet in, in like a, in an hour. The fuck does he care about taking the fucking pictures or whatever? This is stupid. He wants to blend in with society. Okay. He could be a king. If 
If I had a fucking gun, I'd be able to fucking do this, by the way. Bitch. Damn, like that shit. Ugh. This is ridiculous. Fuck these motherfuckers. Take them out one at a time? Like, I don't know. Whatever I can do. Bitch! Oh, come on! I punched him in the fucking cock! Fuck you! This level! It's pissing me off! It's not a big deal. It's fine. It's just a video game. Right? Sure. <laughs> That's all it is. Video games will never piss you off. Never happens. God damn it! fucking green guy. You eat like that! Ah! I'm not even speaking words now. That's a fucking alien language. Now I'm now I'm creating a, my own language. This is it called uh, my, my own like rage language? Like rah, rah, rah. I sound like a fucking Tasmanian devil. <laughs> the fuck? Somebody needs to get me some fucking medication. <laughs> Swear to fucking god. I think this has got some major fucking problems going on here. Swear to fucking god. I don't know what's going on. It's these fucking games, man. You play ever play this shit? You ever play this Dick Tracy shit? You ever get to level fucking four in Dick Tracy? You'll be speaking an alien fucking language. Just try it. Actually, I did, Mike. I played this game when I was five years old, and I didn't have a problem. You didn't? Well, good. Good for you. You're Mr. Fucking Perfect, aren't you? That's fucking great. I'm glad. I'm glad everything is fucking going perfectly for you. If everything's so fucking perfect for you, why the hell are you watching me? Everything's so fucking perfect for you. What are you doing here? Looking at this shit. <laughs> Dead grandma gaming? Wait, what? <laughs> that out of all that shit, I'm talking about Superman, whatever. I look over and somebody goes, dead grandma gaming. <laughs> what? What about your grandma's dead? And she's gaming? What? What is happening? I can't even follow my chat. You know what I was saying before about how all I do is read my chat? I, no more of that. I'm gonna start reading novels. No, I'm not. Love novels. Romance novels. Where are those Star Trek ro I got some Star Trek romance novels around here somewhere. It's like Captain Janeway getting on with Seven and Nine. Oh, ho, ho, ho. In the, in the 10 forward. Lord. The green guys are the worst. They're, they are the worst. If you read chat enough, your brain makes its own novel. Yeah, exactly. It's true. Peace. 
All right, haven't got hurt yet. Never say that when you're playing the game. Oh, I'm doing well, because you know what'll happen next. You're fucking dead, it's over, motherfucker. That's what's next. You scum. Ha, ah, punch him in the fucking chest. How'd you like a punch to the heart, bitch? Clark? Punch to the nuts, too. <laughs> After I punch you in the chest, I'm gonna punch you in the nuts. <laughs> Motherfucker. This guy's got a fucking gun. This is bullshit. Why doesn't Dick Tracy take their gun? You're, you're killing them. Take their fucking weapon. What are you, stupid? Fuck! Dumb dick. Dude, I hate this fucking level. I hate it. I hate it. I hate this fucking level. It was fine up until this point. Now I got no. Like, how do you do that? You know what would be nice also if he could kind of like skirt along the ground, if you could like move on the ground, you know? Can't do that, you have to stand up to walk. Now I get shot in the fucking neck. He can't slide, he can't move along the ground, he can't fucking do anything. He can't do shit. He can stand and walk really slow. I'm Dick Tracy, I can move as slow as molasses, but only when I'm standing, so that I'm a giant fucking hitbox target for all the fucking 10,000 enemies and their 10,000 fucking bullets. That's what I can do, I can become a giant fucking target. That's my superpower. I'm a big fucking human target. Don't you want to dress up as me for Halloween and look like a big yellow fucking banana? The man in the yellow hat? Whatever the fuck. Whatever the fuck kind of fucking character this is. Who even is he? Look at this shit. Oh, this is the first time I... This guy's gonna throw this at me. I'm gonna get hit and die. You fucking scum. Get up, get up, you son of a bitch. Thank God. Oh my God, I finally got through it. <sighs> Never again. These green fucking knife bastards. The hell kind of shit is this? Now I'm on, now this is gonna be even worse. I should just give up now. I swear to God, I just fucking give up, give up. That's my attitude, by the way, when I play games. <laughs> Just give up. Give up now, let the game win. <laughs> That's my advice. Mike, how do you beat all these hard games? I don't know. Just give up. Just don't do it. <laughs> do something else with your time. Find something more worthwhile while to do and play a 30-year-old fucking game. <laughs> That's my That's my advice. Just give up now, let the game win. Look at this son of a bitch. You can't even, what the hell was, is this? Oh, cause he's, he, I thought he was in the background. Fuck you. Oh, you son of a fuck. No, I'm gonna beat this. It's gonna, maybe. This is fucking nuts. Who, who knew, who knew? This game would be so fucking hard. How far am I in this? For 4B, how, how the fuck long does this go on? There are like 10, Z it goes to. Isn't there five stages? If there's five stages, I could probably do it. If there's more, if there's six, like if it goes to like six three or something or six C, I'm I'm not I'm, I'm not making it. There's seven. There better not be fucking seven. Brisby says there's six. All right. You might be too old to beat it. I think so too. I think I'm much too old to beat it. Like, far too fucking old. <laughs> I agree with you. You're right. I can't do it. <laughs> he 
Should get a, I should get something to pass. You get to a certain age and you just get a pass. Like, how, how old are you? You're 52? All right, you, did you beat level one? Yeah, I did beat level one. All right, you, be, you beat the game. You're 51, you beat it. You get, just get the age pass. It's like, you, buddy, <laughs> it's fine, man. You, you won, you beat it. Consider it, consider it one. <laughs> I want a fucking car. I want to make that. I'm gonna make cards for old guys. Gamer, gamer cards for old guys. These companies could sell that. Official from Sega. Who made this fucking game? Who developed this fucking game? Anybody know? No idea. We earn the pass. That's right. You get to a certain age, you just earn the pass. Jesus Christ. Sega was the developer and the publisher. Okay, so Sega. So Sega would make... Sega wouldn't have to do it. Let's say, all right, 55 years old. You get the 55 year old pass. You play Mario 1, or no, no, that would, no, it would be like, you play Sonic, you play Sonic 1, did you beat level one? You win, you did it. <laughs> Sincerely, Sega, the Sega Corporation. God damn it, man, this is crazy. Holding your ground and throwing infinite grenades is is a good tactic. Can't blame the enemy. Yeah, you, you notice I don't have any fucking grenades. What do I have? The, uh, at least this stage I have a gun. The other fucking stage I only have a fist. I don't have any guns. I don't have any slide. I don't have any duck walk. I can't duck and walk. I can't fucking... I can't stab them. They can stab me. I can't stab them. You can't do dick. Thank you, Pepperoni Secret. Pepperoni Secret. So, yeah. So, Secret Pepperoni, Pepperoni Secret. Raiders from the Pepperoni Secret. Uh, uh, this is Dick Tracy for the Sega Genesis. That's what we're playing here today, as you can see. If you can't tell that that's Dick Tracy, I don't, I don't know what to tell you, but that's Dick Tracy. And I'm shooting shit. That's what we've been doing. It's sort of a, I don't even know what you call this. A run and gun? Not even, sort of. It's kind of a platformer, it's kind of a shooter. I'm struck. I don't even know. Like, what would you. What would this be identified as? Because it's kind of like. I feel like this is several things combined. The closest thing I could feel like I could call is like a run and gun, maybe? Let's see. What would a slow walk and gun? <laughs> side scrolling shooter? Okay. Side scrolling shooter? I, yeah, I guess so. That makes sense. Side scrolling shooter. I just, because of the background shooting, makes it a little different than like, you know, like Contra or something like that. I guess that makes sense though. Fucking this part, man. this shit. What? <sighs> Through like a different distance than the rest of the fucking time? Fucking blow me, motherfucker. <sighs> motherfucking shit. Dude, I, oh. Dude, fuck this guy. Oh my god.
He is. I will kill these motherfuckers. I will kill them all. I will kill them all. I tell you what, though. This is a very fun game. You know, I'm kind of... I've been kind of making fun of it or whatever, but in, in all honesty, I actually really like this game. It's a lot of fun. I wouldn't be playing that this long if I didn't like it. Well, that's not necessarily true. Sometimes I play shit I actually fucking hate for a long time, so... I don't hate this, though. Fuck. Like Bart's Nightmare, I fucking hate that game. <laughs> I fucking hate Bart's Nightmare, if you didn't know, by the way. Oh, man. I'm so glad that I got an A plus in Bart's Nightmare. You know what that means to me? I never have to play it again. Because I never want to play it again, because I fucking hate it. I'm blowing you out of the headlines, Tracy. Like, looks, the face looks like a fucking ball sack. Jesus. Hey, thank you, Jay Salter84 for subbing with Twitch Prime. Appreciate that. Lord. You, you need to buy the invulnerability suit at the cash shop. Only 10 bucks makes the game so much funner. It, if there's a fucking invulnerability suit it, that I don't know about I'm gonna have a fucking meltdown so there better not be a fucking invulnerability suit I'm gonna assume that's a fucking troll comment there's, there's a 95% chance that that's a troll comment but then there's like a you know a 35% chance that that's a real comment does that math make sense? I think it does. Makes perfect sense to me. Look at, look at this shit. Prune face. Took long enough to come out. Okay. Good. As long as these other guys don't come. If it just stays like this with only him, I can fucking do this, no problem, I think. Okay. Shit, shit, shit! Oh my god. Don't, at this point, please don't fucking kill me, come on. Look at one more fucking hit. Thank you, God. All right. I think if he would have hit me one more time, I would have been there. Where's big boy prune face? 
bonus shit. I like this part. All right, here we go. It's gonna be harder though. You missed three bad guys. Hit one good guy. Man. You gotta be so fast on that part. All right, stage five. Searching the warehouse. <sighs> this is basically turning into Sunset Riders at this point, right? Actually, that, that's a good comparison. Good comparison. Give you fried chicken KFC gravy? Sure, just to Dustin. Lucas says this looks extremely repetitive. Um, I mean, sure, but when you're actually playing it, it's gradually getting harder and harder. Uh, so for me, it doesn't feel that way. It might look that way. It probably looks that way, but it doesn't feel that way. Um, because like if you were actually playing it, um, I don't think you'd feel that way, but I can imagine watching it. It would seem that way Mike you got Star Wars 42 millimeter theatrical No, it's it's 16 millimeter <laughs> But yeah That's all right Is this based on the movie or the comic? Uh, I mean, at this era, I'm probably the movie. The new Wonder Woman movie, holy shit, so bad. Yeah, I've heard that. I, I've heard, uh, I haven't watched it. I saw the first Wonder Woman movie, and I, I thought it was, um, I thought it was all right. Uh, I liked it enough. Uh, so, but yeah, I heard the new one's not very good. I haven't watched it, though. Let's see. Oh god. Oh, this is totally different. All right, so I'm up top here now. All right, interesting. This is like really throwing me off here. Oh, fuck. All right. It's the first level that's been like this. This is weird. This is definitely making it harder. I'm not used to this. Oh my god. Okay. This is so weird. I had no idea there was gonna be a section like this. Oh, man. Great. If I can make it to the checkpoint. Oh, I guess zero guys. It's like, is that, is it game over right here? No, I have three credits left, okay. No, like legit though, I I I, am, I enjoy this game. I think it's pretty good for the most part. Damn! My fucker! That sucks. Oh! Oh, man, they're just wrecking me here. Oh, I guess I got to do him when he sits up. When he sits up, I had to do it, right? Here, 
right, like this, I gotta do this until he sits up. Now I know that. away at my health. Oh no. Huh. That. Oh wow. I mean I could probably get down to the bottom by dropping, huh? I don't know. It's not like there's hell. I'm gonna go, I'm more. Oh, what? You can't walk down there? I thought you could drop down and, and walk down there. God damn it. I had no idea. Fuck me. Well, that sucks. Now I know. I think I made it to a checkpoint though. Ah, uh, fucking sucked. Stand up. There you go. Oh my god. Stand up. He's not gonna. I fucking shoot this guy. I don't even know. Okay, I don't literally fucking. You gotta get close to him, I guess. Ugh. Bitch! I'm on zero fucking lives again. Great. Two more continues. Fucking shit. This guy's got the shittiest gun, only three round. Yeah. Don't jump. They're saying, don't jump, don't jump. Oh, now I'm looking over at the chat. A little late. A little late. I know that can be frustrating, by the way, because I've, I've watched other people live stream. I get it. You guys are in the chat like, oh, I can help Mike here. And then he types something, and you're like, he'll read that, and he won't die. And then I die. And you're like, what the fuck? He didn't read. I wrote it. I wrote it three times in the chat, and he didn't even see it. And then afterwards, I look over like two minutes later, and then I read your comment. I know how frustrating that can be, because I've done that myself. But, you know, when you're playing games if you, I don't know if you've ever live stream but if you haven't ever live stream it's a lot to have lots of comments in the chat and then you got this game going on and you're trying to do commentary and all that so sorry but it's just it is what it is all right Sit up, motherfucker. Okay. Good. And this, I just gotta get. Oh, there. Okay. Okay. Any background? 
on, dudes. <sighs> like, I don't get that fucking part. Fucking dude, I hate him. Bitch. Don't respawn. I don't think they do. See, that's good game design, the fact that they don't. Make it? All right, and I have two lives. <whistles> Driving? Probably. More driving shit. This is gonna be the worst. So far so good though, I guess. I can't, the early levels would probably be so easy at this point, you know? Now I kind of really know the controls more. Remember the first time I did this, I was like, what the fuck? It's a good thing the car doesn't have, like, health, too. Real visioning that car and make sure the dudes are popping out and see like this. I know they're fucking coming. Oh, he shot me too. Come on. Ah. My God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Dude, enough. This is the worst. This is the worst. When is this gonna end? Please fucking end. are like killing me. I haven't like blinked for like 10 minutes. <laughs> That's what it feels like at least. Oh my god. <sighs> How is your driver not riddled with bullets? Right? He just has like an iron mask on or something. <sighs> uh. Alright, I'm gonna take a break for just a minute. I'll be right back.
I am back. I had to like rest my eyes for like one second. God, you ever play games long enough where your eyeballs, you just have your eyes wide open for such a long time that it feels like your eyeballs are just gonna like dry up into prunes and then just fall out of your head? That's what's going on here. <laughs> Sounds healthy, right? Is that what is that what gaming being a gamer is all about? <laughs> Having your eyes rot out of your head. <laughs> You're not a gamer until your eyeballs fucking fall out of your fucking skull. <laughs> Swear to god. I lost both of my eyeballs when I was 4 years old. I am a true gamer playing Yars Revenge. 500 hours straight of Yars Revenge. Your eyeballs fall out or not, even if you keep your eyeballs, if you play 500 hours straight of Yars Revenge, I would say you could definitely consider yourself a hardcore gamer. <laughs> 500 hours straight of Yars Revenge. Look at this motherfucker. Eat lead, Gappa. Ugh. What's this shit gonna be now? Another one of this fucking crap. Eat lead, motherfucker. Bum 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 bum. Ah, you can break all the plates. I like that. I like it. Do 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 do. Got a pool table. They're reusing the same fucking level. Cheap. Reusing the same shit again. What kind of shitty game is this? We're using the same backgrounds. Come up with something new. Oh, it's a fucking time limit, dude. Just realizing that. Great. That I don't like. Don't don't have a fucking time limit. Or if they do have a time limit, like give me an extra fucking minute. How am I gonna fucking do this? There's like no way to fucking avoid this shit. Dude, how can you do this? How am I supposed to avoid that? I can't, I mean, hop over it maybe? Over it or duck under it, or I don't fucking know. All right, flat top, whatever. Where are you? I guess you jump over it. Oh, in both directions. Yeah, okay. I see. Yeah. Fuck. Okay, so now I know at least. Fuck. At least I know what they want now. I think you can duck under that. Depends how high or low it is. Okay. Okay. Minute 35 for this shit. Fuck. All right. Now I know how to do it. It's the level. All right. It's the level of how high or low that is. I run out of fucking continues though. It sucks. Shit, 
this guy's nuts off. Ah! Ah! God damn it. Having these other guys in the way is not helping me. just duck under a lot of it. But sometimes he'll do this. Alright. I got you, motherfucker. I got you. Now I know how to do it. Now I know your secrets, motherfucker. God. It's like dark. Oh my god, fuck you. Great. This sucks. Bitch! It's fucking goes dark! Fuck it, that's fucking sucks. Couldn't make it easy, could they? Of course not. It wasn't fucking easy anyway. Now they can fucking fuck, fuck, fucking fuck, fuck, fucking fuck! Last fucking life now? Now it's fucking over. Because this shit. Just kill me. Just fucking shoot me. Somebody come out and fucking blow my head off. Now where are the enemies? Kill me. Go. Shoot me. <sighs> All right. save like all my fucking life for the end of it because it's gonna be fucking dark or whatever sucks you gotta make sure you do fucking perfectly the rest of this shit and then there's these motherfuckers these fucking fuck Low ones. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. Good. There. And going back. Okay. luck on this, right? Oh, I don't have another? That was it? 
come on. <sighs> How much fucking more was after that? Is there a whole nother level after that? Like, where the fuck was I? Yeah, there's a, like a fucking purple and then the docks and shit. So there's, I think there's one more whole level and then a fucking final guy after that. Rogue Heron says, such hell. Yeah, there's stage six. So there's a whole nother... It's not like after that it just goes to Big Boy. It's like there's a whole nother fucking stage. Jesus Christ. Every game should have unlimited con continues. That's dumb. No, having unlimited continues would be dumb. Because, see, now this forces me to play it again and get better at it. Because, obviously, I didn't do good enough. If it had unlimited continues then you could just keep playing it over and over and over and it wouldn't force you to get better at it. So you, you just would suck continually forever. So if I play it again and start from the beginning, I have to do better as I go through, get there with more lives and do better and get better at the game instead of sucking. So I don't agree with that at all. But that's my opinion. You're entitled to have yours. <laughs> Somebody goes, yeah, fuck that. Use, I use Game Shark. <laughs> yeah, just use the Game Shark. That's all you need. Sure. <laughs> just put in the beta game button. That's all you need. Let's see how, um, should we see how hard this fucking shit is on the hardest setting? Now I want to know that, so, what was I playing on, Nor normal or easy? I, I don't even know what I was on, normal or easy. Let's try it on hard. Let's see how fucking hard this is. I, oh my god, I could have given myself more lives. Let me make sure this is on hard. Yeah, it's on, it's on hard. Alright. Here, let's try this. Now I'm putting it on the hard setting, because I have problems. <laughs> Let's see how much worse this is. Let's see if I can beat level one on hard. You know what though, that's a good way to practice. See, I played on hard, and then if I drop back down to normal or something, then I'd probably be a lot better at the game. Then I could beat the easier settings, you know? It's like more guys and fucking shit, and they come faster, I think. beat this game on fucking hard. I wonder if the, yeah, is there like any kind of like code or something that un would unlock uh, like an even harder setting? Sometimes games have that. It's like Bucky O'Hare. You don't know that it has like hard, but you put in the password. It's like hard ex exclamation point and then there's actually like a hard setting and shit. I did that. That was fucking crazy by the way. I don't know if you guys remember that stream. It's probably a few years ago now. I still... That's enough that, like, that was crazy enough that I actually, I'm still remembering that. That one's stuck in my memory. <laughs> Bucky O'Hare on hard. Fucking crazy shit, man. Fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, I don't even know if I can be level one on this setting. Shit. This is I, this is like super addicting. This fucking game. I actually really like it. I'm definitely gonna want to try to beat this. Fuck! Wow. Yeah, that's hard on fucking hard. <laughs> it's hard on hard. We, you wouldn't you wouldn't think that it'd be hard on hard, but it's hard on hard. So I, I at least made it to the checkpoint though. Oh my god, look at all the fucking energy that takes away. Holy shit. 
Jesus. Like, how do you avoid that? Fucking wild. This definitely is making me want to play Sunset Riders, too, though. Which I haven't played in quite a while. That game's so fun. So it's sort of a similar kind of thing. I don't remember if there's really much shooting into the background, though. I know there's that mini game, I guess, where you kind of do, but I don't think you like shooting into the background normally. It's such a good game. You know what game's actually really fun too, if you have never played it? Uh, Gun Dot Smoke. That, that one's fun. I beat that years and years and years ago for, for the NES. But um, that's a good, that's a fun game. It's hard. Gun Dot Smoke. You start with four blocks of health on heart. Oh, and this? I didn't even notice that, really. Shit, fuck that. <laughs> One left. That's crazy. So is that the main difference? The amount of health you get? That's fucking wild. Oh my god. Yeah, I, there's no way I'll do this on hard. I just wanted to see it. I'm just curious. I was just curious. But nightmare mode. Dick Tracy <laughs> Genesis nightmare mode. Actually, you never know. Like people, it could do like hacks and shit. You know, there could be something like that. I, speaking of like Genesis hacks, hold up a second. So I have like a. Uh, I have some different Genesis hacks. Let's actually look. So that's enough Dick Tracy for now. That game's really good. I like it. Um, I want to say uh, something like. Make sure it comes up. Yeah. Um, all kinds of shit. Um, it's a Bloodlines hack. Enhanced color. It's just like colors. A color hack. Contra hardcore hack. Darius too. Oh, this is all like enhanced colors. I don't even know this fucking shit I have. Is that what this whole thing is? Home brews. There's home brews. Oh, yo. You know what, too? Um, Mega Cubert. I remember that. There's a the Xeno Crisis game. That's really. I remember being good. <laughs> Let me try this. I forget. I tried this like once. It was cool. I think I think this is like a twin stick kind of thing. I forget. Like a Smash TV kind of deal. Maybe. Yeah, I think so. Let's see. Yeah. People are gonna think this is Dick Tracy too. Let me just put on like Genesis. Sorry, I just put in a different fucking game. <sighs> like Smash TV. Yeah, it's like a Smash TV kind of thing. Oh, you've run, run out of fucking bullets? I didn't realize that. Shit. Are we saving them? Yeah. Look at the monsters, they look good. You got like different kinds of guns and stuff. Boom. Uh, and you got grenades and shit. You pick up all this other stuff. I wanna see what the bosses are like. Room clear. 
This is also on Windows. How is it twin stick on Genesis? It's not. I was just saying it's not twin stick. It's just D-pad and um, buttons. Oh. Shima. Fuck. Okay. That's, and that's it. <laughs> it fucking wrecked me. Okay. I want to try this again. Bah! Sort of shoot off the walls. I can't like kill these little fuckers. It's, it's a problem. Jesus. Come on. Use all my lives. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, you can't kill them. Well, they're a major fucking problem. So with the other, so you can spin. Okay, hold up. So you can spin around with C. Actually, that was like fucking me up. Okay, it's a little weird. So C, if you tap C, it like spins you. Oh, actually, if you spin either one of them, actually does it. And then you run out of ammo? I don't like that you run out of ammo. I don't know. Alright, there's that. Let's see what this other shit is. Spam grenades at it? I didn't have, have any grenades. Oh, okay, so this is... Was I even playing? Okay, yes, I am playing. And I cannot fire anything? I'm trying to figure out how to fire. I, maybe you can't fire? Try everything. Maybe this is only avoiding. Let's get this. Oh, it's only points. I think you're only avoiding. I think this is a pacifist bullet hell. Okay. Alright. That's weird. Pacifist Genesis bullet hell mod thing. Quite the idea. Oh, I got a bomb. All right. A Toho kind of thing. You want your cave games on Genesis? Interesting. It's a, you can't shoot though. Let's see, let's see this fucking cubert. Mega cubert. Yeah, I want mega. I want mega cubert. Whoa! Look at these graphics. <laughs> what? You create your own stage. Uh oh. He's very slow. I like the graphics. They kind of remind me of Cubert. <laughs> this is all I need right here. Fuck it. Fucking done. Got what I want.
that Zion isn't completed. Oh, that game's not completed. Oh, is that why I couldn't fire? It's not finished? <laughs> oh, okay. I guess that makes more sense. I thought it was like a pacifist game, which was kind of interesting because I hadn't seen like a bullet hell that was a pacifist thing. That could, that, even if it's not like that, that's, that's an idea for somebody to try. That makes more sense though. I mean, this is cool, but it just, I, it just seems pretty much like a version of Qbert. I don't really see. There's Sam. It's this. Is, I mean, this is definitely cool. I like it. But I thought maybe there'd be something like a different take on it or a different spin on it somehow. But I mean, this is a good. This is definitely a quality version of Qbert. I don't really have anything to say about it, but it's cool. It's it's good. They did a good job on that. Tanglewood. No idea what this is. Do I have Tanzer on there as well? I don't know. Maybe? Is that a good one? Tanglewood. Is it a fox? Okay. Anybody here of this game? So God is visiting a box in the woods or something. Oh no. That's what my God looks like. <laughs> Tanzer, a fast paced side scroller action game. Oh, okay. Is this what Dora the Explorer sees? Yeah, when her eyes are wide open. It'd be awesome if we could like start the game. All right, here we go. Okay, so C buttons, jump. There's no music. I don't know if this is finished or whatever. Is it a fox? I guess it's a fox, right? I don't like. Uh -huh. It's got that like a fez kind of music. It's just like, you know. Okay, what the fuck is this? Is that a lemon? I don't know. know what you're supposed to do so I, I don't know I don't know what you do um oh shit do I have hacks bootleg I got all kinds of fucking hacks and shit I don't know, fuck, even know let's see what's under the let the numbers Family, Batman and Robin hacks, Aladdin, Aladdin's Disney's Abu. Is this a game just of Abu? I want to see this. That would be awesome, actually. Oh, 
Let's see. I hope that I'm a boo. Oh yeah! Okay. not work. I was like excited. It's like broken. God damn it. That sucks. I was actually kind of excited about that. <laughs> I was like all ready to fucking do that. Damn it. It's always something. Balls. Balls 3D. Bat. Batman. Oh, all kinds of Batman fucking things. Batman Returns. Revenge of the Joker. What are the differences? Batman Forever. I don't even know. Battletoad shit. Beauty and the Beast. I don't even know what is on here. Blaze Doom. Yo, is there a Doom something actually that's Doom on here? Let's see. Yeah, there is a Doom. Doom 32. Oh. I don't know. I don't even know if that would work. Here, let's try it. Yeah, I, I don't have the... I don't have... I'd have to pop it into 32X. I don't have that in right now. Actually, I mean, I have the 32X. If I find that, I could do that. Uh, what else? Double Dragon Arcade Game. Double Dragon 3 Genesis Invincible Edition. Like, I don't want that. This is just regular Double Dragon 3. I don't even know if I remember Double... What, fuck, get, like, get me out of the hack thing. How about, like, regular... Is there Double Dragon 3 just for... There is. You know what? Now that I'm thinking about it. There's a Double Dragon 3 just on Genesis. I own, I have it. I think I remember not liking it. Hold up. I want to put this on real quick. Because I kind of remember putting this on one time and I think I didn't like it now I want to remember Flying Edge Dick Tracy hack oh yeah I want, there might be I should look I didn't even think Rosetta Stone oh is this like the NES game I don't remember Look at this fucking jump. I remember playing this one like once before and like cause I actually own the cartridge. You can go in the weapon shop and shit. I was playing this on something just the other day. Game Boy or something. I think there's a Game Boy Double Dragon 3 and it's like. It, that was bad. The Game Boy Double Dragon 3. <laughs> the hit detection in this is terrible. It feels like I'm not even hitting it. Get the fucking... No. That, I played that before and I didn't like it and I still don't like it. Fuck, the, fuck Double Dragon 3 on Genesis. Dude, I don't even know. Let me, let's look up the... the oh, f hold up. Let's go to the hacks. Oh, no, wait, where are they all? Hacks and bootlegs. And let's do Dick Tracy. Because we were playing Dick Tracy, and let's see if there are any Dick Tracy ones. There is. There's a couple. 15 lives. That just gives you more lives. Dick Tracy... Magic game? I don't know what that means. And then there's... What? I, like, I don't know what these are. Let's just try the one, this one. Let me see if I can tell what the difference is. Wonder if this is like any different. Seems like exactly the same fucking thing. Alright, so I don't know. 
I don't know what the difference is of that. Let's try magic game? Like, what the hell does that mean? <laughs> it's playing magic? Oh, it's like in another language? I guess this might just be in another language. Yeah, I, that's all. Okay. So, I don't know if I have, like... And then it's just more lives. I don't care about that, so... Russian, they're saying right, it's just a Russian version of it, okay. Quack shot, Maui, Mal, Maui Mallard. Doom 64, 32X. Nah, I wish I had my 32X out. Um, I, I'll, I'll have to do like a 32X stream. We'll do a whole 32X stream another day. What other shit? Fantasia, Fatal Fury, Felix the Cat. Felix the Cat on Genesis? I know the NES game. I don't know Felix the Cat on Genesis. Do I? Do I know that? Try Musha? Musha's great. Listen to the fucking music. This is the music? Talk about not fitting music at all. I mean, it's it's kind of cool music, <laughs> but like, it does not fit this fucking game whatsoever. <laughs> I like the music though, it just doesn't fit. Fire Shark. Oh wait, Fire Shark. Isn't Fire Shark a, that's a shmup. That's like that has another name. I can't think of it. Like V or something. Fire Shark has another name. I, I'm pretty sure. Let's put this on. That that the music was ripped from Mega Drive thing. Fire Yeah, look, hold up. I want to try this. Oh. oh shit. Yeah, fucking fire shark. It's a, yeah, 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 same, same, same. That's what I'm thinking of. Thank you. Same, same, same. So this game's called either fire shark or same, same, same. I think it's more well known as fire shark. But whatever, this is just a schmuck. That's cool though. Like, I would totally play that sometime. Fix it, Felix. Sorry. By the way, um, if you're just like popping into the stream now, we played. I played Dick Tracy on Genesis for like an hour or something or two hours, and now I'm just like looking at random shit. So if you're like confused of what the hell's going on, I'm just like looking at other shit right now. That's all. That's all, and that's no joke. Joe and Mac. Judge Dredd. Hey, uh, Judge Dredd. I am the law. Landstalker. Fuck, uh, fucking Lion King hacks. Dude, fucking... What are the fucking Lion King hacks? Lion King 3? New game, Lion King 3. What the fuck? No, I had this. Can I like grab? What the fuck is going on? 
First of all, can I like... Dude, he has like a fucking... Look at this fucking like guile fucking attack. Oh, there you go. I thought I could do that. There you go. What the fuck? It's like, Hadouken! Oh, nice. Th thanks for, like, hanging on to that. Oh, my God. Fuck you. What is the fucking... Dude, balls. They get, like, fucking hitboxes from hell. I mean, the actual Lion King game doesn't have great fucking hitboxes either. Oh, this is, like... <laughs> I'm going through the f everything. He's fucking pink. Hold, I can't even get up there. Jesus. Grab it! This is fucking broken. Come on. One more try. One more fucking try. Dude, fuck, get, fuck you. Lion King 3. The fuck was that? Mad bomber? Like a boom? Hold on a second. Wait, what? Like, it doesn't even start. This doesn't start. What is this shit? You know what this shit is? A bunch of shit that I never fucking looked at, and I don't even fucking know what I'm look. What? I, you know? Mario three around the world on Genesis. Okay. Something. Oh. What? Yeah, oh yeah, I thought so. Wait a second. Uh, what's coming out? is going on I feel like I'm on drugs what the hell is this now oh I went through the block is there something wrong with the music that's what the siren sounds like in Batman here we go I'll turn this up I am the siren Mario. Okay. That was that. I don't know. <laughs> Somebody help me. Some for the love of fucking God. What is going on here? Time for Pyramid Head? Mario 1 and Sonic 1? It's not spoken like that anymore. Same is the Japanese word for shark. Oh. Okay, so it's not like same, same, same. It's pronounced like something that's different. Okay. 
Mega oh yeah, Mega Man Wily Wars. Mega Man Game Gear on Genesis. Mega Man Game Gear for Genesis. See that? It's not, it's not even gonna work. <laughs> it's like, no, this is for Genesis, Mike, you dumb shit. Uh, Mega Mario. Okay. Oh, that works great. Okay. I wish this Genesis wasn't 45 feet away from me. Mega Cubert. Wow, look at all these Power Rangers games. What even are they? Prototypes? I don't know. Armadillos. Flink? The Misadventures of Flink. Who the hell is Flink? Do you guys know who Flink is? Somebody in my chat said, YOLO says, penis butt, penis butt. Adventures of Fink. Mr. Nuts hopping mad. Now we play nuts. <laughs> Pretty much, right? Is that a spaceship? Is he an alien? Like, squirrel? Can't he just be a regular squirrel? What the hell is this? Not 
what I was expecting from Mr. Nuts. There's a chicken over here. What? This is not the Mr. Nuts that I know. Not what I expected. Is that shit pickle? Shit pickle. And these look like mounds of shit right here. I, what the hell? It kinda. Bing Apple, 3 a.m. Tommy Lasorda. Transformers 3? Oh, that's going on. Who even is that? I'm, I'm a Transformers fan and I can't tell you. Who the fuck is that? This is not Transformers. The fuck shit is this? Also, that totally, it's like the pyramids? What the hell? What is this? And it totally, hold on, wait, what? It said, am I going crazy? It fucking had like the Michael Bay, like. Yeah, that's the fucking Transformers logo. That's like definitely Transformers. By the way, why does it? But what is this game? This has nothing to do with Transformers. You don't remember that episode might come on? No, I don't. I do not. I missed that episode where the characters in Transformers look like this. Anybody remember like Optimus Prime? Remember those days? Nah. Welcome to 2020. Here's your fucking Transformers. I don't know. It looks like more like a putty from Power Rangers or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I feel like I've lost my fucking mind. Like, is am I really streaming or is this like a dream? You know? Like, what the hell is all this crap? I mean, I guess that's what happens when you start looking through hacks and weird shit, right? Oh, Undead Line. That's actually a good game. Unlimited Trees. Unlimited Trees. I want to play Unlimited Trees. It's just Sonic. No, it says Unlimited Trees. How, what? Is that it? It doesn't even go to level two? <laughs> Come on. That was it? That's the whole, I beat it. And, oh, I, I started it over. Seriously? Okay, that, I beat it. Unlucky pony. Unlucky pony? I should really put the 32 accent. What the fuck? We'll do that. I'll, I'll do a 32x stream. We, we will do that. Yogi Bear. <laughs> hey, boo boo! Here you are to pick your best gift for you! Dude, is this gonna be like that Super Nintendo game? Please, God, be. Ranger Smith. 
be like a month by the time we get through these fucking menus. And it's like a snow level, right? I think I remember. Is it snow? Is it sad that I know that? <laughs> yeah, it's pretty sad. Z, what's under Z? Zombie terror. Zero wing. Oh, that's the all your base belong to us or whatever. Zool. Dude, I don't know. Z Zontar's Mega Swirl. Oh, that's one of my favorites. Let's play Zontar's Mega Swirl. That just came on the screen. What that? What is this? I thought this was gonna be a Bubsy thing. says Mystic V. Not in this game. I don't think they're in this game.
Thanks, you frog dude. <laughs> Got this shit. It's like a Wonder Boy kind of fucking. What? There's no like sound in this game. Any X Men hacks? There might be. Oh, I can look. This is Last Mage on Earth. How many hacks have you missed? I don't know, a bunch. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> I like these graphics, actually. It's too bad the... Is this a real game? Has anybody ever heard of this? It's kind of actually... If the sound fucking works, it might actually be cool. This guy looks cool. He actually does. Like, look at that. That's kind of cool, actually. It's a prototype. Yeah. The graphics, like, look, yeah, they look clean. I don't know. It's too bad. I guess it's not finished, though. It's too bad. Looks like it would have been all right, actually. Uh, somebody asked for X-Men. Let me say X-Men. Yeah, actually, it looks like there's several. X-Men hack. Let's, let's try that. It's a canceled game. Oh, that was a canceled game. Okay. Gambit. See, I'm not familiar enough with that X-Men Genesis game to really know what the difference really... Well, I don't think he would jump like that. <laughs> Some kind of jump hack or something? It's like, it's like he can fly or something. There's some kind of weird shit going on. He jumps. That's part of the hack. He like jumps higher or something. So I'm not super familiar with the. With, I, ha, I have played it like a, a very small amount, so I know of it, but I haven't really played it much, so I don't really know. But you can totally just like fly over. Look, you can just like fly over shit. It's like some kind of cheap hack of the game. Oh, you can just. I think it's just switch. Or I thought maybe you just like switch characters or something. Oh, he comes in. It's like a special attack comes in. Is that like Archangel or whatever? Can we get him to come in? Yeah. Let's get them all to come in. How about him? <laughs> the fuck? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It's all fucking weird. He has infinite jumps. Yeah, apparently. The bottom row are assist characters. The top row are playable characters switched between... Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not super familiar with that one. I know the arcade game, you know. Yellow Sonic Adventure. Is it just going to be Yellow Sonic? Most likely. Oh. That's the ugliest thing I've ever seen in my life. It looks like somebody pissed on the fucking screen. Like, not, like, seriously. Why would you do that? Like, what is the point of that? Is there, like, I can't think of a reason why somebody would do that. These colors so good. There is no reason for this shit, none, somebody said. <laughs> I don't, I don't fucking know. Oh my god, is this gonna work? Zelda Game Boy for Genesis? I 
I think this is all it is. Somebody just drew it on the screen, I think. I mean, good drawing. <laughs> but I think that's all it is. <laughs> just, that's it. Just a picture. Okay. All right. That's what, you know, I don't know. <laughs> probably one of the best hacks I've probably played so far, though, I'll tell you. <laughs> I swear to God, the good old Zan Zanok Bazur. Let's play some Zanok Bazur. Or it crashed. It might have. I don't know. Some other Sonic hack. I don't know. Sorry, I'm kind of like running out of things here. Mega, I don't fucking know. How about some of these things? These are probably like a little better. Um, I think a lot of these seem to just be like enhanced colors, but let's see what that even means. Like the Lion King enhanced colors. Now the Lion King already looks pretty nice, so I'm actually curious about... Let's see what this actually looks like. What do you mean enhanced colors? Cause I, I mean, I don't really like the Lion King game very much, but it looks nice. It starts. Like, isn't this what the other one looks like? Maybe it doesn't. I probably have to go back to the other one and fucking compare it. Shit. Don't, don't you fucking meow at them and they jump and fall over. I forget how to even play this now. Maybe this this guy does. That guy does. These guys don't, I guess. So I don't even remember. I guess this looks different. Shit. Fucking like stink bugs and shit. Remember you could like go on the side here. Can I still do that? Play for me. You get this, and that's like the life upgrade thing. Remember all this bullshit. You get like this, and you get like this. And that's one of the life upgrade things for the whole fucking game. Like, you need to get that. That's a checkpoint. This right here. This is a secret. You go in here, and you get the one up. And I think you can still go to. How do you roll? I forget. Let me figure this out. Yeah, like that. You roll down here, and then there's something else, I think. Yeah, like continue. Oh, it's like an extra continue. Yeah. Alright, now I'm gonna fuck. Now, now I wanna see what the actual Lion King looks like. What the hell did that look like, Lion King? Now I need to know. Thank you, Soap Dirty, for the sub, and Master Shake, also for subbing. Thank you, guys. Don't I prefer the pink Lion King? Yeah, right? It's stuck. I don't even, I can't even tell the difference. Does it look different to you? This is definitely brighter. Yeah, I mean this looks, if anything, this looks better to me. <laughs> Actually, I don't think the other thing enhanced it. I think this, I think this looks better. More detail on the plants. 
I think I feel like that looks better. I don't fucking know. Enhanced colors. What else was on here? Shining force. Oh, twinkle tail. That's cool. Well, let's put that on. Twinkle tail is fucking good. I played that before. See, I'm not gonna remember long enough though that this game's actually really good. I guess the colors are a little different, but I don't remember. I'm not familiar enough that I can tell the difference. I remember really liking this game a lot though. I never did beat this game. I, sh I should go back and beat this. It's, it's hard. I love how this game looks. See that this is like a real, this is this I would sit and actually play, which I have before. I, I've tried to stream that whole game before. I made it pretty far in that game. I think I made it near the end, but I didn't beat it. It got tough. Anyway, I don't know how long can this go on for. I'm just going <laughs> fucking through every like fucking game. Um, Darius too. That's probably cool. Sonic 1 Metal Sonic Hyperdrive. I'll see if I have it. Hold up. Um, I guess under hacks and shit. So Sonic 1. He wants Metal Sonic Hyperdrive. I don't even know if I have it, dude. But like, then there's a million fucking Sonic hacks. So like, if anybody sees it, yell at me. Let me know what page page it's on. Sonic 1. Metal. What is it? Metal Sonic Hyperdrive? Oh, yeah, there's so much. Well, here. Um, Sonic 1 Metal. Oh wait, Mecha? Wait, is it Mecha or Metal? Metal Sonic Hyperdrive? How many versions are there? Holy fuck. Yeah, that's why I'm asking you guys to look too, because I'm, I'm not gonna fucking, I'm gonna miss it. I'm trying. There's like so many. Now we're into Sonic 2. I don't even know if I have it, man. Sonic all the time. Yeah, I don't know if I have it. I'll put on a different one, though. Um, let's see what else. I thought it said South Park for a second. <laughs> Could be. There's, like, South Park shit. Sonic 1 Planets in Marble Zone, like... Back in time. Sonic 1 Boom. But isn't there a, Sonic, a game that's just Sonic Boom? This is not, like, Wii. Doesn't it suck? I've never played it. Let's try Sonic 1 Boom. It even fucking works. Is it not gonna work? God damn it. Never mind. Sonic 1 Alpha Hoax? Fucking no. Sorry I don't have that one that you're looking for. Sonic 2 Metal Sonic Rebooted, isn't that? Okay, Sonic 2 Metal Sonic Rebooted. I don't know, man. I don't know if I have that. Like, isn't that funny? All this shit that I have, I don't even fucking know. I don't know. I don't think I have those ones you're talking about. Sorry. I have all kinds of weird shit, though. Sonic 1 Lunacy? It's probably just like a really hard version of it or something, right? Which I suck at Sonic, so that's not happening. 
Sonic has a nightmare. Okay, let's see that. Supposed to be like a horror Sonic or something. They said nope, nothing. Yeah, I don't know. I don't. I feel like I don't know. It's like nothing. Let's get out of Sonic. Let's do something like something else. There's so much of it. It's crazy. Squirrel King. Sport game. Splatterhouse. Splatterhouse. That's cool. Play that Tasmania game on Super Nintendo. That fucking sucks. Taz is just like running down the street, and it's like nothing else. Like a bunch of Tetris stuff. Adam's family. He has an Emperor's new hedgehog. It's some probably Sonic the Hedgehog fucking hack. There's like eight bazillion of them. Lost World Jurassic Park. Muppets Mega Drive. The Muppets. Yeah. Okay. Come on, work. Don't not work. Fuck you. Fuck you, game. Thing. The Punisher. The Punisher. I wanted that to work so fucking bad. Tic-tac-toe. What the hell? Tiny Toons. I mean, that could be cool. TM, what the hell is this? TMNT 5 foot? I want to see what that is. Okay, this is going to be a, a Hyperstone Heist thing. What does that mean? 5 foot? It's just like the reg it's just like the fucking regular game. It's like what even is that? Oh the ones with the bin don't work? Oh, alright. Well now I know. Good. Toy Story shit. That's Transformers 3. See I wanna find more weird shit like that Transformers 3.
I don't even know. I don't know if there is anything else. You. Did we even look at you? I don't, I don't know if we did. UFO. There's all this Mortal Kombat shit. A lot of Mortal Kombat stuff. All kinds of shit. Unfair Sonic. Probably like half of those fucking hacks are unfair. Let's see unfair Sonic. Just how unfair. Well, I like how the menu, the screen is like fucked. Stupid. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. Like, what is this? Instead of a life bar counter, you have a death counter. Yeah, exactly. I don't even know what the fuck this is. Oh. <laughs> it's probably g really good. <laughs> Up. Robo bug. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna fuck fucking beat this game. Then he destroys it. Yeah, I fight. <laughs> I play through this whole game, I beat it. I don't even know what this this game's called. You guys want obscure shit? <laughs> Here you go. People are like, Mike, you should. You know, it'd be good for your channel, Mike. You should stream uh, Street Fighter Four or Smash Brothers. I'm like, uh, I don't really give a shit. Like, Mike, you know, you know your channel, you'd get, like, way more views if you played, like, games people care about. I'm like, yeah, but I don't care, so... <laughs> so I'm gonna play this bug shmup. <laughs> if people want to stick around, they can. And if not, <laughs> then they don't. Oh, well. I'm playing the fucking bug shmup, motherfucker. You'll be sorry you didn't see the end of the fucking bug game. Yeah, look at this. Look at this shit. Look at what you would miss out on. Streets of Rage 4 doesn't have this fucking thing in it. <laughs> the fuck? It's actually kind of cool. I actually, I like, I like the bug shmup. The fuck was that called? Uzu something? I don't know. They're like, yo, bruh, Marvel vs. Capcom 2, bruh, why not? That's right, yeah. Too easy? Actually, yeah, it was a little easy. Oh, that, Guy Aries is fucking hard. I've played that before. That Gargoyles game. 
I don't know what all this is. I'm not sure. GDL. It's probably a popular franchise, and I can't think of what it would stand for right now. General Chaos. Gen Genghis Khan. I wonder if there's any Star Trek shit on here. Ghostbusters. It's a, oh, it's a hack of the Ghostbusters? Well, wait a second. There's a bunch of Ghostbusters shit. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait. Oh, and Ghouls and Ghosts? Oh, I didn't look in here, did we? Hold up. I gotta check this shit out. This is interesting. Um, prototype, color correct. What about this one? Do re Egon doesn't work. All right, ghouls and ghosts. <sighs> this is just like other revisions, I think, of ghouls and ghosts. I don't think it's gonna be anything special. God damn it. <sighs> Glay Lancer. Gods. Oh yeah, remember that Gods game? That game is fucking great. Globulous. Globulous. Goofy's Hysterical History Tour. <laughs> I tried playing that game before and I could not fucking, like, hear. Have you guys ever seen this fucking Goofy game? If it's even gonna work. Hey, Mexley! It's not Scrooge McDuck, by the way. Fucking, uh... Ludwig von Strange Duck. Ludwig von Strange Duck. It, it, Goofy thinks he's fucking bionic commando here. You know what those fucking things look like? Those th looks like those things in Dark Souls. Dark Souls has like these fucking guys. These mushroom motherfuckers, I swear to God. Yeah, I don't know that there's any, I think this is just a Russian version of this game. I never fucking liked that game. Never fucking liked that game. <laughs> Mike knows how to pick them. Yeah, aren't these great? Aren't I picking great ones out? Gumball the cat? Okay. Did I just see Grand Theft Auto V on there? What? Looks like a mess. What were they uh, trying to trying to do here? It, th th it doesn't even the loop doesn't even work. It, it doesn't even work. Maybe because I'm supposed to go up here. Oh duh. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't tell. Yeah, didn't you know?
<laughs> Be careful, it might affect your TV, Mike. Yeah, I know, my TV might never work again after that. Wow, oh my god, Jesus, God, gravity pig. Gravity pig? Oh, it's bins, that doesn't work. No, damn it. Green dog, beach surfer dude. Somebody mentioned that earlier. Is this Normie's Beach Babarama? Or wait, what? I'm so confused. I don't think I'm even playing. What's going on? Oh, now I am. What's he? What is he throwing? A piece of gum? He's throwing a piece of gum? Honestly, like his face. What? I can't even tell what his face is. What even is that? Is it his face just like a ball? With like a... I don't even understand what I'm looking at. Do you guys understand? His hair is a hat. I, I don't even... I can't even like visualize it. His balls have faces on them? What? Who needs a face? This is really fucking odd. It's a farmer hat, they're saying. Yeah, but I know I know he's got like the hat. I get that. But like his face isn't like a face and then he's got like a thing coming out of his neck that goes down to his stomach. What kind of character? And look at his arm. His arm is like a fucking noodle. <laughs> this is the weirdest looking thing. Now he's got an umbrella hat. Oh, jungle hunt. Motherfuck. What the fuck? Fuck game is that? Okay, I I'm in the weirdest fucking games here today. Yeah, did you, Grand Theft Auto Five. Oh, it's a bin file. It's not gonna work. I'm gonna try it anyway, just in case. I 
like that this is Grand Theft Auto 5. It's like, it's like unplayable, but I... It's like, ro like Road Rash or like, who knows? Well, it's definitely not Grand Theft Auto, but hey, at least it worked. I'm surprised it fucking worked. What the hell? Well, this has been the weirdest bunch of shit ever. Oh yeah, this game. I want to see this real quick. 10 out of 10. Yeah, it was great. This game I keep forgetting about, and I feel like this is a shooter that I think I like. Yeah, this fucking game. I really need to devote like a full stream to this game, and I always forget about it. The title, because it's got such a fucking not memorable title, it's like Guang or some shit. What, like, what even is that? But the game itself, I remember being like pretty good. Kind of like Legendary Wings or something. Which, that, that game's pretty good. Yeah. Anyway, so, that's... I'll look into that another time. Alright, well, I played a lot of shit here. Um, actually, wait, did we look at anything Pac-Man? I wonder if there's anything Pac-Man thing. Like, what is all this shit? Oh, Raiden. Raiden Trad. I don't fucking know. I just want to. Let me look at Pac Man. I think Pac Man. Oh, Pac Man. Pac Mania. Pac Man 2. Let's do this. This one, the new adventures or whatever. Yeah. Ugh. This is. I thought this was just on Super Nintendo. Maybe that's what the deal is. Somebody got it to be on Genesis. I never understood how to play this game. All right, that's not what I was hoping for. Panorama Cotton. That's cool. Pantufa the cat? What the hell's that? If I don't look, I'll never see it. Not that it'll work, right? Nope. Oh, wait. Was that the, Did he say the Macarena? Wait, what? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Was he saying the Macarena? The fuck? like Pepsi Man, but it wouldn't let me be Pepsi Man. What the f fuck? Maybe I have to unlock it. That's cool, though. That's fun. That's, like, funny. He 
must have to unlock them. Okay, yeah, that's what I think too. Well, this one seems pretty playable too. This one might actually be alright. Hope you like your. Hope you like it. Paperboy. Somebody said it's from a. One of the characters was from a streamer. Uh, one of the characters in there was? Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I'm not sure. Alright, well. Pikachu the mouse? Sonic. This, that's that's kind of cool. I guess. <laughs> do this where you can dart forward and it's like really fucking me up. And you really care you get used to that. thing that exists. <laughs> balls, they're saying. Don't lose your balls. <laughs> no, yeah, it's just ROM hacks shit. Pit Fighter. You guys love Pit Fighter, right? Pitfall 32X. Oh, the Mayan Adventure. I f that's actually not bad. Pink goes to Hollywood. <laughs> Pole? Poo tie? That is it. The other thing said chode. Nothing to do with Pooh. It's just like Sonic the Hedgehog. Poo tie? I thought it was gonna be like somebody with a tie made out of shit. Come on. Pocahontas. <laughs> They're disappointing me. Why is there no tie made out of shit? What the hell? What kind of hacks are these? Sa oh, there's a Sailor Moon thing. I should see this. As in the intro. Is this the one that's just the fighter? This is like the fighting game. 
Moon person power. Yeah. Is it even fucking working? It's like not even working. So that that's like, I think that's on Super on Super Famicom. I think that's the Super Famicom game. Like they're trying to get it on Genesis or something. Pulse Man. Punisher. Did we look at Q? I don't think we even looked at Q. Quack shot. There's like not much under here. Okay, that's too bad. Da, 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 da. Rastan, Ren and Stimpy shit. Red Queen Rampage? Is that like Rampage? Like, I guess I'll look at it. Like the Rampage we all know? Oh, no, it has nothing to do. This might be just like a. What the fuck? <laughs> not what I thought that was going to be. Return to Genesis. Who the fuck is this asshole? What am I looking at? What the hell is this? Oh. You want obscure, there you fucking go. I don't know what the hell that is. Ring, the ring, Sonic hack. God, there's so many. I think there's enough Sonic hacks. I think we could make other kinds of things. Jesus Christ. Rock and roll. Rock and roll racing is a cool game. Oh, wait, rock. Some kind of rocket night hack? Man, I wouldn't that'd be nice if this was if this is quality. Let's actually look at this. Cause Rocket Knight's so good. Could this be like a quality fucking hack? That'd be awesome, actually. Let's see. Now I'm really curious what this is. If anybody notices a difference, let me know. Like so far, I don't fucking notice anything different. Oh, look at the lives. 99 lives. Well, that's not, that's like the last thing I would want. What, what's this one? Will it even work? Probably not, right? It's the bin. Oh, no, no it's going to work. Let's see what this is. So, the Rocket Knight's such a good game. If you haven't played it, you should play it. I think this has stage select. Is that why? I could have picked a stage. I think, I think it has stage select. Okay. Okay. Um... Thunder. Royal Blood. It's like an R type. I'm curious to see what this what R type this is, if it'll work. Nope. Nope. I don't know. Getting down to did we look at M? I don't remember. Madden, Mad Bomber. look interesting. Let me see what you guys are saying. Anything look interesting that I went through that I didn't fucking click? Return it to Toys R Us. <laughs> Marble Madness. Japan. Marble Zone. Did I look at this? Wait. Did I look at this Mario 3 right here? Wait, let's see what this is. Oh, that's, yeah. That's that same thing from earlier. Mario Inside. That's just gonna be Mario Inside. Meh. Mecha Sonic and Sonic 1. Is that that fucking one that w dude wanted earlier? Hold up. I think this is that one that the guy kept asking for earlier. He's probably gone now. Oh. Well, 
that's why he, wa he wanted me to see it. That's kind of cool. is fucking god now. Dude, Sonic should have just looked like that. Look, look, look at this motherfucker. It's like a Mecha Mewtwo. Mecha Mewtwo Sonic. He levitates at, at high speed. <laughs> it's like... Mecha Mewtwo. The fuck? Imagine if Sonic always looked like this from the beginning. Back in the 80s. You had Mario and then you had this motherfucker. Mario wouldn't have stood a fucking chance. Look at this fucking thing. Resident Evil. Uh, okay, let's see if there is one. Was there? There is a Resident Evil. Thank you. I looked over that. Thank you. That's Resident Evil, apparently. <laughs> okay. What the hell? I don't know. All right. Well, I could like do this forever. I should. I should stop. <sighs> Body count hack. Yeah. GTA Five. I tried it. It's just like a Mad Max weird fucking thing. The ro oh yeah, Rocky. Is this gonna be like the Master System thing? Let's see if it's any different than the Master System. Or if it even works, probably it won't even. Some of the bins work and then some of them don't. So that doesn't work. So. Don't stop until you find one last game you wanna try later. I don't know if I found anything that I wanna watch later. <laughs> um. Radical Rex. You got, this is like the baby baby T Rex shit. Ranger X. I think I played that. Rainbow Three. You know, people said I, I never really liked the Genesis Rainbow Three that much. Unfortunately, never got into that. Road to Valhalla. I don't know. Give it like a K. Oh, I might not have ever fucking click this. Kirby and Sonic. I mean, it's just another Sonic hack. Kung Fu Kid. Kung Fury, Streets of Rage 2. Is that like the... Should we look at Kirby and Sonic? I don't know. 
Let's just... Fine, let's just see it. It's, it's probably just a fucking sprite swap. <laughs> Maybe it's well done, though. Spit out coins? Fuck. <laughs> Whatever. It's, you, see, you see what it is? Kirby can't bounce. Why? Somebody goes, why? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Exactly. Why? The fuck? Like, why? Exactly. I. Eat the mortal. Fuck that. Indiana Jones. Sector X, Iron Man. It's something. I hog that hate hedge. I. What? Basically, just go to the left, Sonic? Didn't start that way. This is so weird. I never thought I'd see. I never thought about it, Sonic going the other direction. That's so fucking strange. That makes me, like, really uncomfortable. It's just, it's, it's just gone. It's just reverse. It's a mirror. It's like mirror mode, Sonic, is all it is. All right, that's just so weird to see, though. I never even thought of something like that. Ivysaur? Ivysaur. Hey, thank you, Ven Dar Darith, for... Uh, the sub, the gifting a sub to Ben Mation. I appreciate that very much. <laughs> okay, that's pretty funny. <laughs> That's pretty good. I, I, I'll give him that. I, I, I like that, actually. <laughs> it's just a sprite swap, but for some reason, that one's pretty funny to me. <laughs> look at him go! Look at him go! Look at him go! <laughs> I want a fucking Squirtle one. <laughs> Look at his little legs go. His little feet. <laughs> and his face at the end. I actually kind of like that. They did a pretty good job with it. Probably like a Jigglypuff or something. <laughs> this is the only Sonic game you need. Right here. Forget the rest. <laughs> that's really funny, actually. I like that. Whoever did that, that's good. 
Good lord. Funny shit. Oh my god. I don't know. I feel like I've looked through fucking everything here. Um. Let's see. J? Did we? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I don't know if I looked through Jet and Sonic 3. Jewel Master. Jim Power. I don't even know. Just, just red. Eh. I don't want to. Jurassic Park stuff. Justice League. Justifier. And something like the Sega Justifier. Oh, Haunting starring Polter Guy. Remember that game? Hell Cobra. Sounds like a shmup of some sort. Home Alone 2. Hypersonic spin dash. It's too many fucking Sonic things, I swear to God. Hook. I don't know. Out. Just something called Out. Oh, mummy. Okay. I'm sold. Oh, mummy. Cobra Kai, season three, January 1st. Yep. Maybe this is the game. Somebody's like, you can't leave until you find a game that you want to like actually play. It's probably this. It's probably gonna be this. Anybody here remember Mummies Alive? Ooh, another another one's coming. So what do I do at this point? I don't know. Oh, I had to go back to the beginning. I'm gonna make my whole channel about Mummies Alive coming soon. There's going to be some changes coming soon. My whole channel is going to be uh, reviews of Mummies Alive, and also I'll, I'm going to start reviewing um, different types of mayo. So stay tuned for that. Going in a totally different direction. The fuck is this shit? That it's not over? Didn't I fucking do everything? There. Now I go back to the beginning, right? And then you do another one. Okay. Well, that exists. Oh, mummy on Genesis. That's not like a real fucking thing, right? Mayonnaise alive. There you go. And people would be like, gee, Mike, a good attempt to, to be, like, funny. Sure, mayonnaise reviews. Wait until they find out I'm actually going to do mayonnaise reviews. And, and they're going to be longer than Lord of the fucking Rings. I'm going to do, like, a... How long is Return of the King? Like, three fucking hours? I'm going to do, like, a four-hour review of fucking mayo. That's what I'm looking to fucking do. Exactly. <laughs> the Return of the King of mayonnaise jar reviews. Rastan... Rastan's a fun game. Actually, I, I do like Rastan. I feel like I looked through Rick Dangerous, Rick Roll. Well, what did I expect? <laughs> Richard Scary, Rick, Rick Dangerous, Rick Dangerous. <laughs> I thought it was going to be something other than that, not, instead of literally just Rick Roll. <laughs> okay, Indiana Jones here? Okay. Is this like an actual fucking game? Oh, 
it's up to jump? Ew. Okay. Oh, come on. I might kind of like this, though. Can you jump off the ladder? Yeah. Pff, fucking fuck you. It needs more music, that's for fucking sure. So he goes to there. Ah! Fuck! Alright, well. That might actually. If it had some fucking music, that might be playable. Rings of Power. Richard Scary. You guys remember Richard Scary? It was like books. Kids' books. Gonna work? No. Never mind. I was gonna try, but no. No, no. Roman. Roman two on two. It's too much. Robot dreams and synth screams. Is this just like a music thing? <laughs> 